Yo. 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 Nice shirt, dude, even though I don't think you ever played N64. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, shut dude. Really shut up, games. dude. You're not you a gamer, know. bro. Stop. Shut yeah, the fuck up. Yeah, shut up, dude. I got N64 in my room right now. No, you don't. Talk shit. Say we won't pull up. Goldeneye. Us three right now. Oh, Tournament. Fucking dog Tournament. you. Tournament. 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 He keeps saying this. He's never, he'll never do it. He'll never, never do it. Never do it. Tell me, never do tell it. Me, tell hey, me, tell it, me you can get a faster speed run on Castlevania than me. Shut the fuck up. Go ahead. This, this is the same guy that always, I won't be one of you in Valorant. I won't be one of you in game. And he never does it. He never does it. diamond is No, I solo queued it. We're really doing this right now? I solo queued to diamond three, dude. I literally am immortal right now. It's an ego thing because you were carried. I'm not. I saw you get carried. I You've watched never you get seen carried. It. I You've literally never seen it. Seen it. Bro, never, I joined your lobby. If, if, if you joined my lobby, you would see 30 kills, but at least a, an 89% headshot percentage. You no, you and and the fact that carried. you're denying carried. those stats carried. tells me a lot about yourself. You've been carried. And you just cap a lot cuz we've been supposed to be playing a for, lot for months now. Like 2K launch. What I look like to you, bro? Before that, a we were supposed to be playing. Before that, before yeah. that. September, the other 2K launched. Before no, that, before AJ, that. Before that. In the summer? Yeah. Yes. We how long been, have you had? How long we have you had? We could have been done in the summer. We've been and waiting for. You didn't for? do it. Oh, that's on you, bro. Stop. That's on you. Because you're sir caps a lot, bro. Hey, listen, we could yes. have a 64. Yes. I didn't first play 64. First. I literally played more 64. First things first, low. I got my feet. You ain't got no. I got my feet done for the podcast, man. What's crazy is aim. Wearing socks. Yeah. Like John is wearing socks too. Yeah. I got my feet your socks off, man. I got my Take feet done. Off. Look at my Me? Instagram yeah. story. Take Fuck socks no. Off, Fuck them no. Listen, I, I, listen, I told- listen. John, hey, listen. I uh, first of all, just look at this part of my body. All right. We There's see a it. lot of hair going on here. Mm-hmm. This goes all the way down here, comes all the way. You know what I'm saying? Across your whole body. You just right. don't ever, don't ever, don't ever do that again. I mean, I kind of like. You didn't like that. You didn't no, like that. I didn't, I didn't like it because that, that hand stopped in the area a little too long. I didn't like it. Like you that. didn't like that. Yeah. Uh, I ain't like it either. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, come on. No, no, no. But I told a lady, bro, I was like, I'm back. You know, what I'm saying we have a podcast to do. Let's get my feet looking right. She said valid. I'm not gonna lie to you. That's what she said. She said valid. She to said you. valid. Yo, she said the valid people to at you. this spot, they this know me now. This caps a lot, dude. dude, they, just, I, dude. they just they just know <laughs> I tip well, so then they just give me the best treatment. It's incredible, man. I'm off at my iPhone going off. You can go ahead, go. You can go. My bad. Oh yeah, no my problem. My iPhone was going off. Yeah, no bad. problem. Frequency well, interference. Your pie. It's your pie, bro. Hey, welcome back, everybody, to another episode. Yeah, more energy than that, bro. Oh, the peer to peer podcast. I'm your host, Agent Zero. Today, I'm joined with my co-host. Yo, the podcast people is the one and only legend of winning, aka Low. And we're back with another podcast. You didn't say that this time. I normally don't say it when it's your podcast, but and we back with another episode of the Peer to Peer Podcast, bro. Hey man, we got a special guest with us. Specialist today. of all specialists. Not too special. No, no, he's, he's special. He's, he's real special. special. Okay. You're the specialist. He he's yeah. He's you a, are. You're the specialist of guests. That's like that's what you are. Such bro. a special guy. <laughs> Thanks, hey. John. Real special, man. We got the one and only yeah. streaming extraordinaire. Yeah. One of the most entertaining entertainers Talk in a. the business. Okay, wait the a second. The one and only. Talk to him. Straight out of Kentucky. Oh, you killed it. It's, listen, they know I'm from Kansas, and I want to stop the pod real quick because this is serious. If you ever fucking say that I'm from Kentucky again, I'm not only going to light you up in front of your friends right here, but I'm going to light you oh, up wow. in 2K. I'm going to light you up in Valorant. Can't I'm going to light you up things. wherever you, you think that there's darkness. You lose in 2K, you're trash. He Can would. You he would. Bro, I'd, I'd beat both of you. Bro, I'd beat you. I'd beat bro, you. I put up to one of his 2K streams one I'd time, be, I'd be and he was missing I'd wide open with the sharpshooter in like 2K19. What? Swear. I was watching, and he's like, what? That was a white? I was like, hey, why are you streaming you breaking wide open shots? That's I crazy. never did. I literally, I didn't even want to be in your, I didn't even want to keep leave a comment because like, I'm Podcast, embarrassed. don't listen to him. I'm embarrassed that this is don't happening. Don't listen to him. You're looking at a semi-pro, um, incredible. Oh, I didn't finish my intro, bro. Go ahead. Out of Kentucky, the <laughs> one and only streamer and entertainer and yeah. new time podcaster. Yes. Aim high. Thank Welcome you. Aim high to the podcast. Thank you. Hi, I'm Aim High. Uh, I appreciate being on. I appreciate the invite last minute to come on here. I appreciate that, Low. Appreciate that, yeah, Agent. Yeah. I think off rip, people are going to look at you and they're going to be like, what a luscious, extraordinary beard he has yeah. going on. Facts. Um, yeah. I, like, off rip, we're going to get to all the intro stuff. Sure. But before all of that, because we know I've had people click on this podcast. Talk right? to me. Ice ass beard. Yeah. Thank you, John. Clear, ass crystal ass clear beard. I like your fucking hat, dude. Appreciate it. I know they can't see it. I can see it. And yeah. I, it says, I yeah, love go ahead. men. Come here. 
What's Look at that. Yeah. D2 receiver. What's it say? Look at that. I love... M- oh, I didn't see the wool part. Okay. Wha- Woman. You be trying to yeah, play my you be man, really John. trying to... I don't like yeah, that. You trying to play me? Yeah. yeah. I don't like that. It was on an angle, John. No, I ain't no, see it. It was on You like angle. that toss, didn't no, you? No, you try, like, try to play Spotify, it. Spotify, yeah. Google Play, Stitcher, man. Thanks for showing love. Apple Podcasts, people. We've just about 3,000 five stars, man. Drop a five star. 3,000 five stars. Yeah, no care. Wow. Yeah. You guys are killing it then. Yeah, drop yeah. a five star, man, saying John. However you think his name is spelled, you're probably going to get it wrong. Nope. I know how it's spelled. How you spell it? J-O-N. Oh, wow. Look at you. Fucking Say it. I ain't going to lie. We try to throw H in there all the time. Why? Like, yeah, we're. He, he doesn't, doesn't even look like that, John. He looks I, like a J-O-N. Exactly. It's a difference. Like, yeah. I'm glad you see that. No, I... I you he, looked at me, he, you he's, he's giving off a vibe I'm giving out no H know, vibes. Yes. No <laughs> H, a, no no H, H vibes. No H. Um, <laughs> he's a no word H Word of mouth, John. people, man. Thanks for showing love. The video is available on YouTube at Peer to Peer. Type in Peer to Peer on YouTube. Yes, you guys can see mm. our beautiful faces, the luscious yes. cameras, and of course, my feet that just got done by a professional. They do look good. They, they look incredible. They man, do look good. They and I'm, such great care. She literally did like three coats of like the clear thing. I yeah. was like, why are you doing, you doing the most right now? Like, you know why? why you, you know why she like did this? that? Why she do that? Because she's that type of woman to do that for you. If she said, yeah, valid. If she said valid, if she to said you, valid. Asian yeah. lady too. She said valid. You pull up to the spot, bro. They yeah. got the she Asian said film. In Toronto accent. Yeah. She said, Yo, man says valid, bro. And I was like, word. I don't even know people talk like this in Atlanta. And then, <laughs> and then you look at the TV and they got the Asian film, but in subtitles, but it's like, like the generic one where the guy falls in love with the girl, mm. but the girl has to pretend like she don't fuck with him. Yeah. And then at the end, they just saw they're falling in love and the dragon, there's usually a dragon involved. So for some odd okay. reason, and I mean, at the end of the day, it's very heartwarming. But you yeah. sit there and you watch the whole film. And then um, when the film is over, they ask you questions like, uh, so do you bite your nails? Because mm, they, they look at your nails. And I, yeah, I do. That's a bad habit. And we talk about my nail biting habit yeah. just about every time I pull up. I mean, that's besides the point, though. I mean, I, I want to ask something really quick. Is va- valid? Is valid? A tor- is, is it Toronto lingo? Because mm. I want to say something that Among Us lobby that I told you I was I was getting in. There mm-hmm. was a girl in there that was from Canada, but she was not from Toronto area. I was asking her about, you know, if she had been to anywhere Where in she Canada. I honestly it was like the middle of Canada. Probably Ottawa. Maybe. I don't know. Actually, it might have been. I don't know. But anyway, she was like <laughs> talking because I was like, oh. Because at first she didn't say that. She was like, I'm from Canada. Mm. So I was like, I have a friend who's from Canada. Mm-hmm. You. Yeah. Him. And she was like, where's he from? And I was like, Toronto. And she immediately, like the whole lobby got quiet. And she was like, I don't mess with Toronto people. She's from Montreal. And I said, I said, I said, why? Why? She said, their lingo's weird. And I said, what do you mean? And then she made this crazy, obscene accent and was like, bear, bear. And I'm like, but I remember you See saying that? bear. And I was like, bear is a lingo. Bear. But this, this right here, aim high. What you're referring to is a serious inferiority, inferi- yes, inferiority, in- inferiority, inferiority complex. Inferiority. And this is usually stems from people that live in Montreal. I know. Uh, inferiority. That's hey, John. Search that yeah, shit. Up. That's John a fucking word. That? Yeah, John. Yeah, yeah, search I'm on it. I'm on it. Yeah. In- inferior. John, what that say? What Google say? It's, it's, like, it's like inferiority inferior. complex, yeah, yeah, but yeah. the opposite of that shit. Okay. It's the people that feel like they're lesser, so they have to shit Insecure. on them. That's that's one word. It's definitely that's insecurity. Just, insecure is just a, a, like a one big word. Because yeah. you can be have a superiority complex. Yeah. Inferiority complex is a philosophical. How you do it, John? Huh? I don't think he's the right one. Huh? To ask this question. Uh, psychological huh? term used to describe people with intense feeling of. Man, I left my glasses. Okay, yeah, that's yeah, okay. That's okay. That's that's okay. We'll move on. We'll try to do that. Yeah, hey, yeah, we'll, we'll move on. Don't worry about it, John. Don't worry about it. We'll, we'll hey. get Phantom to no, teach you how to. Don't worry, don't worry. Any big words, let's just run it before the, we start the podcast. Yeah, my bad. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, let's yeah, just that's run that's it before. Bad. I'll clear all the big words that want to use on this podcast. No, that's bad hosting. Yeah, for sure. No, but that's what that is. And for some reason, for some reason, people that live in Quebec, they just feel that way about about people in Toronto. Canada feels that way about Toronto. You know why? I do know why. Because Toronto's just better. I literally why. Yeah, that's literally why. And I can't help that. I can't help that's that. People just, in America who who are like, oh yeah, L A sucks. L A is this. L A is that's because L A is just better. Yeah. But better. like New York, they'd be like New York. Five sucks. years ago, L A you could have made LA right Sure, now. yeah, yeah. I'd, I'd rather I'd rather move to uh, Texas now than L A. But but, but the point is, is like uh, Toronto's just oh. like the biggest city. And they do the same thing with Vancouver. Like, you don't think people in Edmonton are like, fuck I like Vancouver. Vancouver. Vancouver's a cool city. Yeah, without a doubt. But yeah. people hate on Vancouver, too, because it's a bigger city. Yeah. Uh, and then people in small towns, they, they just, it happens at all levels. You yeah, feel me? You're right. So whoever she is, she's just hating. It is kind of, it is a little bit corny sometimes. The accents are just funny. 
Mm-hmm. I don't. I don't know too many people that do them seriously. You know I've never. Saying? I've never heard one. Before, like that's not. But. That's not anyone I know's default voice. Okay. <laughs> like that's just a voice that. That's what like do they sound ax- like? Hmm? What do they sound like? I don't know because I can't pull it off. But oh. you know who who does do it well? Um, I think it was Corn for, for, for y'all. Oh. oh, they most definitely do. But for y'all entertainment does it like. Oh yeah, without a doubt. With the but best. That's ones. not how they sound though. But they could turn it on. Yeah. Type shit. I don't okay. really know anyone who sounds like that. Throughout the day, yeah, <laughs> like yeah, like, yeah. Or it I, might be, I mean, people like in the inner cities, like in the hood, they might maybe not like the high ass voice that they be doing because Drake does it too, where he'll do like this high ass voice and he'll yeah. just throw in like bear, like he'll just do something <laughs> bear, just like that, <laughs> bear, bear. But they don't sound like that crazy, but like I think it may just be like an inner city thing. But in Atlanta, maybe. they definitely sound exactly how you think they would sound. Like if you're around enough Atlanta, like. In the ghetto, grew up in the inner city. Mm. They sound exactly how you think they would sound. That's run that shit low. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Oh God, try to put it down. Me and my partner, now we went in the street real quick. God, oh God, now fuck him. That just lame man, nigga. Lame man, lame man. Me and my partner, and them it reminded me of that song that uh, which accent is the same, Mike? No, that song, dude. That's the whitest my partner in them. I can't. Yeah, my um, my partner in them. My, my, my partner in them. My hey, partner in them. The, the, the crack lady on the corner, she pregnant. The pit bull, she pregnant. Everybody pregnant in here except my partner in them. That's what he. That's what the song. I don't remember what, what song. song is this. It's either it's a vibe. Huh? It, it's a it's a it, it's either it's a it is vibe. It's a. A vibe oh, by who? saying the song is a vibe? No, the, the song. It, it's it's a vibe. By, by, two oh, by two chains? Two chains, yes. It's, it's a two a chains vibe. song. It's a vibe. It's a and, vibe. Yes, That's and a then vibe. at the end, well, maybe it's not that one. But it, there is it, a two chains song where at the end, somebody comes on. I think it might be YG. And YG's like, hey, my partner and them and like talking. You know, there was a two chains song that went like, I got a big amount. I think I'm the biggest out. That was a Drake verse in the Two Chain song. Mm. Shout out that song, but that's so a good song. You stop us from having this conversation. Yeah, my bad, guys. I just that's such it's a good okay. song. It's okay. We'll move yeah. on. I think I'm the biggest out, and he is. He just knew that by himself. But yeah, dead ass. Yeah, that's 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 the Atlanta lingo, bro. Atlanta lingo. My partner, and them old lame ass. Ooh. Lame hell. Lame. Try to sell me a three five for seventy. Lame hell. Push lame ass, buddy. Lame. Yo. Push ass. Lame 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 ass. I'm trying to push it down low. Try hard in chat. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. To the point where they actually make, they actually yeah, make yeah. like like local songs. <laughs> got they make local songs about like our lingo too. Yeah, like goddamn is an actual song. Goddamn is an actual God song. Goddamn, 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 Oh, man. This is classic. I'm crying right now. Um, XQC actually did that and he got banned. You mean finish your um, thing? Mm, what I do? I'm going to be red yeah, as fuck right now. I'm sorry. That is uh, actually uh, funny. YouTube viewers, uh, if you haven't already, man, make sure to turn the. the We're still in the intro, aren't we? Bell, man. <laughs> turn, <laughs> turn the noties on. Make sure to go. No, no gang, 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 gang. Hey, 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 He's, he day one. He actually know what the fuck is going on. I mean, he's been on the pod before, though. Yeah, true. But you know, I promise you, somebody else who will just forget it. Mm. Um, and then and I want to say this really quick too before we continue. <sighs> we know we I still go back so. and check on my episode. Yeah, we're not gonna finish this. Intro. I still go back and check on my episode. It's a 38k. So listen, I want this over 50, 60, 70, It'll probably 80, over 90, no 100k. <laughs> this, this is probably gonna get uh, two, 300, 400 yes. million. And what are you guys at subscribers? 85. Nah, dude, we're getting a mail off this. This one video? Yeah. Dude, we're gonna have the greatest conversation ever. Yeah, we are. Right, um, sure every every Monday and Thursday. Monday and Thursday. Go ahead. Let's, yeah, let's, <laughs> yeah, let's wrap up. Five <laughs> stars. Uh, Nodi Gang Gang Gang. YouTube. Word of mouth. Fuck Audio Mac. Fuck those guys. Yeah. Actually, Fuck word of mouth everyone is, that works there. Word of mouth is the reason why you're here. Cause dude, keep spamming us like, yo, I need another episode of Aim High. Yes, that's correct. There is mm. someone out there. Uh, my that's boy alumni. Him. Oh, I thought it was your burner. I don't, I, don't have, I don't have a burner. I'd be wild if he was controlling the burner saying, I, yo, where's Aim I at? Where's Aim I at? How come Aim I is not in the videos? Five of yeah. acting where yeah. Aim I is at. <laughs> hey, Aim I needs to be in these AMP videos. Aim I needs to be in these reaction videos. Oh, you yeah. know what's so crazy? A- AMP is like made me way more like noticeable in public. Way really? more. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because I just got noticed twice in, in the same Best Buy. And then I left and came back. 
And when I came back, the um one of the coworker, one of the workers there, she was saying her how coworkers are like trying to figure out was that was that low was that low, yeah. and I was like yeah yeah. So I'm pretty sure I don't think it's a podcast. I think it's the um it might be the podcast. Actually, somebody I got did. noticed one time out here. One time? Yeah, one time someone came up to me and said, "Are you aim high?" And I was like, "Yeah." I was like shocked because I'm not that big. I was yeah. like, I was like, yeah. And he was like. Hey man, do you think you could get Agent Double Zero to sign this autograph for me? And I was Crazy, like, Crazy, <laughs> tough. And I was like, Cool tough, man, nice, tough. cool though, bro. I, and cool then though. you know what I said? I said, Yeah, for twenty dollars. He gave me the twenty. <laughs> I didn't ask you for it, did I? Fucking scammer. <sighs> That's what I like, man. Scammed. Get like scammed. That. Get scammed, buddy. I'm kidding. That didn't happen. I would never take somebody's money. No, why would you? No, it's just we we know that. I would never. <laughs> I would never. I would no, never. Don't explain, no, because don't explain no, the joke. Because, no, because listen, listen, it's very serious when you start taking people's money. Okay. It's mm. very serious when you but, put yourself in that position. But don't, but don't mm. explain the joke. Everybody knows the joke. Yeah. No, it's not a, it's not a joke. Everybody knows the joke. I thought it was real. You did, didn't you, John? Mm-hmm. Everybody knows the joke. John, John's comprehension levels is still at a fifth grade level. So. I don't believe that. It's third. Mm. He was, did, you not, did you not just hear him read? He, he was trying to read earlier. <laughs> he <so>. said... <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was looking at the fucking review for fans phobia over there. He was I don't, know what, I don't, know, what nah, he was, I don't know what he was saying, dude. Yeah. Um, let me read this tweet out because I want to get y'all y'all hot takes on uh, okay. next gen. Okay. Uh, Coda Man says, I was so hype about next gen. Game is a five out of ten. Yeah. Contact dunks every play. Gameplay yep. isn't smooth. Yep. It's just eh. Yeah. Looking like a d- letdown. Six point five out of ten for me. Um, I played it all day today. I need the servers to work before I give it a rating. That'll never happen. And uh, I haven't really got a chance to nice. really play Park. What are you waiting, uh, on, the, yeah. you waiting on the servers? Like, they yeah. just need to so work. So we're not getting it. Because right, yeah. right now they don't work. <laughs> like, mm-hmm. it's too choppy. That like, does not count as working. Um, I'll say, I'll say this. I'll, I've separated myself. Um, not that I was ever, like, really big or anything in the 2K community, but... Um, I really just don't play 2K like that yeah. much anymore. But um, for me, the things that matter um, aren't improved. So I, yeah, for me, it's like a, eh. I think what I am excited about, I'm excited for next year because I, I just didn't think that this generation or this game, not generation, this game would be good just because of the next gen capabilities. Normally games, especially sports games are not good until the second year that they've been on the gen. Okay. So I, for me, it was just, I'd never really expected it to be huge. Um, or like good in that way. Uh, I expect if they flop next year, then it's a major issue and a major problem in my opinion. But nah, I need that shit to be better. I just need the servers to work. I just need yeah. a, just just next gen. I haven't really played next gen though, bro. To be honest, like aside from two K, you're not grinding your badges. Yeah, I am, but yeah, I'm saying I haven't gr- like I haven't grinded Spider Man yet. I didn't even know oh. they released the Little Big Planet. I just walked in with Legion. I saw Sackboy. Do you know they have a new Little Big Planet game? I just found out about that. It's, I have to. I'm not, I haven't been gaming much. I'm not gonna lie. I just been busy dropping videos. So, dropped two videos today. Mm-hmm. Uh, seven out of ten and eight out of ten. That's right. Um, that's it, bad, right? Yeah, it's pretty bad. It's it's bad, but I don't understand YouTube. So. If he, but if you're uploading at the rate you're uploading, that seven out of ten maybe two weeks ago might have been like a three out of ten. But I had a video that started off as a nine a couple of days ago, and then went to such a far ahead deep. One out of ten, it makes no sense. Yeah, I've never seen a video do a comeback my, quite my like LeBron that. LeBron video did the exact same thing. My LeBron Laker video is yeah. that. Is that like? Um, do you guys not really, as far as content, when you start uploading videos, is it is it a guessing game? As far as like, oh, I don't really know where this will land. You just kind of see, or do you have an idea before you upload it of where you think it's going to be at, and is it normally correct or is it normally wrong? Or the only time I upload a video, I don't think is going to do well, is if if it does do well, it'll open up like a content door like a series okay um like today's video is a moments title my second upload and if it did well i could have done more moments titles so it was worth the risk of trying um but generally speaking i have a good idea of what videos will do but often i'm wrong but i'm more right than i am wrong but it's you never really know at the end of the day yeah when it's a series yeah I, you have a way better or at least for me at least i have a way better understanding of um like my draft my nba draft series almost all of them have like high 200 to 300,000 views. Mm-hmm. So I know for a fact, even if it starts out bad, because about half of them started out bad, it would just pick up and suggest it. And it, with NBA videos, or at least with mine, they pick up and suggest it a lot of times. So in, in the first day or two, whatever it, whatever like view is, view count, I don't really care that much. But what I care about is if in a week or two later, if it hasn't really grown that much, that's when it becomes concerning for me. But like, 
there hasn't really been a video where like I guessed it would do great and it just didn't do great and I was like, oh wow, I don't know what what the hell's going on. Yeah. That doesn't really, but I don't really guess that often. If my videos are do great, I just upload it and let it let it play and its let it course. Just go. Yeah, but like the flight video, mm. I, I guess that was going to do great and it did great. My um series with um draft videos, you good? I guess it and it does great. Yeah, put I'm out, okay, put man. Your just, yeah, put on your shirt. Just put yeah, yeah, just, just pull that down. Just yeah, just pull that down. Um, just pull that down. Um, speaking of NBA talk, uh, since I'm, you know, I am a returning guest, we have storylines of last podcast. I want to say congratulations. I picked the Clippers to win the championship. You picked LA. No, no, no I, picked, I picked the Clippers. No, you didn't. You picked the Lakers on the podcast. On the podcast, but when we when before the thing started, I picked the Clippers. Oh, Fucking did you? Idiot. Okay. Yeah. What an idiot. Well, but you're a Lakers fan, aren't you? Yeah, I'm a Lakers yeah, fan. Yeah, so and I, I mean, think, congrats. I picked Miami on another one, and him and Rusty Bucket, an NBA YouTuber, laughed at me for picking the... Um, really? Literally laughed at me. That's really weird. Crazy. But remember, I had Miami playing the Raptors in the conference finals. Isn't it crazy that if Kawhi would have just stayed in Toronto, he'd be back he'd to be, back? He'd be better. He would actually but, be in a better but situation. But the reason, the reason I laughed at you is because Toronto was going to make the championship. Not because they Miami was bad. That second round. Crazy. Are you disappointed with Siakam? Yeah, no. the guy kept doing the same fucking spin move. I don't know why you thought a role player was going to be better. Why do you say dumb things? <laughs> I don't know why you thought that. Why do you say dumb Literally, shit, Literally, in last year's playoff John, Why do you say John, you see what I've done right In here? last postseason run, it became very clear to me that he wasn't like that guy. Cap and artist. Nick Nurse. It was very... Like, What'd you watch? say? Cap artist. I thought you said Kappa. But, uh, Kappa. Either, way, either way. That works too. Um, no, if you watched last year, you know you had a basketball eye. Like a, you know, Kappa. you would realize that Pascal Siakam, at best in the playoffs, 17 points. That's what he's going to give you. Mm-mm. He was averaging about 23 the whole season. You think 17 is going to be the playoffs? Yeah, because he's not a player who has the actual skill set to create his own shot consistently. So, yeah. Mm-mm. I think... That is true, actually. I don't think he has the skill set to create his own shot. He was wild. Yeah, bro, I saw you hop on stream yeah, with yeah, Los and young. argue with him, yeah. and he just shit on you, argument after argument after Who? argument. I saw Los shit on this guy. I now he went on a stream with Los and got shat on by Los, bro. I, I want to say something. I I wouldn't even need to know who Legend of Winning is. Um, anytime someone was like, "Yeah, Los was debating," so I'd just be like, "Oh yeah, he lost." Los lost. Yeah, probably. That's what I thought because too before I, just, I hopped on stream. You should watch the stream. It's pretty brutal. See, any every comment that I've seen from that though was yeah. low wrecked him. Facts. Oh, but that's just because Low's audience. The, he's the joke of the stream, so they had to make fun of him. There's literally people on the YouTube page that has a hundred thousand views now. That literally that made him so happy. <laughs> <laughs> it, lit- his face. it literally there's people who don't even know who Los is in the comment section saying whoever Low is debating right now doesn't know what he's talking about. But you know that because you told me that also behind the cameras. You're, well, you're trying to bait me right now. It's cool. Serious. You just need a little serious cap. Cap. I see you need a little What did you guys content. debate about? Capaz. Oh, okay. He doesn't really know what he's talking about. So no, I wouldn't think so. Yeah, he didn't know too much. But good guy, I assume. Yeah, great guy. Actually, yeah, he seems really, really cool. cool. Level headed, great guy. Yeah. Just basketball. I would definitely know. love to meet him someday. He but not know too much. Um, so opinions and video games, it's not his strong suit. No, no. Um, but wildly entertaining. Anyway, continue. So, how do you feel about um? Because we were talking about this um downstairs about next gen. Sure. You know, you're an older guy. You played a lot of video games in your day. Yeah. You're in your Definitely mid-40s. more than. What'd you just say? Mid. Cut that out. <laughs> John, cut that out. <laughs> Definitely. John, more, I said he's in his mid forties. Cut that out. Yeah. Definitely cut that out, than, John. More than agent. I ain't gonna lie. I thought using your mid forties suit downstairs when you sat there and said, "Yeah, I was eighteen when this game came out." I was like, "Oh, like." The Xbox One. Wait, what, what game? <laughs> I was like, oh, shit. The game with the um the ball stacking. Yeah, the, the, the male the men, thong game. The men stuck, I said stuck. I found that game at eighteen. The, but the you were talking about sixty. Not, I thought you were talking about regular Xbox. Oh like, no, 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 the rotisserie no, no, no. nuts. Like, yeah, I think I was in like middle school when Xbox came out though. So I'll see it because we all were on the same age. Okay. Yeah, I was. Yeah. We were no, talking about the game with the rotisserie. Nah, bro, because I was in middle school with the Nicky Men. The Nicky Men. All right, now it's like third, fourth grade. Yeah, I don't think so. I think I think it came out when I was like in eighth grade. Man, how I time think, how time goes and passes. Yeah, isn't it crazy how time goes? That was regardless um, of whether you want it to stop or just keep going. Yeah, just it, it doesn't stop for you. It doesn't stop for anybody. Nobody. But um, yeah. Anyway, continue. The reason I was asking this question is because um, well, when I was buying my iPhone um today, um, yeah, you know, I was buying my iPhone. Um, I walked into Walmart and literally just walked in and got. Hey, look, I just want you to know, bro. What's only broke people put on cases? Mm. Damn. It's uh. So I got to take off your case. You think, you think TJ got a case? Who knows? <laughs> what I do know is you should be on this 
The breakup <laughs> by another one energy. <laughs> what, 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 TJ got a case? I guess. I don't know. Yeah. You I'm think just, T Jack would I'm judge me saying, if I would bro, get a case on? You can't you can't claim to be a millionaire, bro. You got a case in your iPhone. I take the case, I gotta strip it off. Take it off. I thought, I thought, what was their I thought millionaires did that. I thought like that's even more money I spent. You got a raw that iPhone raw. Yeah. yeah, yeah, raw iPhone. T W had a raw iPhone. You got what? No protection. T W dude. What? No protection, bro. T W. Take it off. Take okay. it off, bro. All right. Hey, John. Don't hey, go. Take you off. Say, no you protection. Say that way too much. Take that too shit off, low. Hey, okay. T dub up, dude. Right now. T- stop. Please Hold stop. Up, right now. Anyway, I asked that because I went to Walmart and the Xbox was Yo, just. Yo, take playing. that shit off. Take bro. it. No. Hey, hey. No. Don't say nothing else to Yo, that case. Strip it naked. Take Over it off. Time. I want to see the back. I want to see the apple button. Big O's. OT, baby. Stop. Back up. T dub up. Stop. Please stop. I want to see that charger port. Hey, hey, I take saw, that chart. Yo, take the case stop, off right now. Stop, hey, stop dick riding my boy over here, huh? Nah, nah. I actually don't back, want why don't you back this guy up? bought a new iPhone and was worried about replacement costs? He's supposed to be a millionaire? <laughs> <laughs> Millionaires can't want to save money? No, they can't. Wow, this stupid they can. Millionaires, millionaires value convenience more than anything else, bro. It's too inconvenient to have that thick ass mm. phone in your fucking. Pocket that thick ass phone, thick hey. ass phone, bro. taking all your space in your pockets. All right, anyway, anyway. <laughs> you, you can't even you can't even fit in your goddamn poor sports car with that phone in your pocket, man. Nope. It just take up too much space. What else he can't fit in it? Yeah, he, he can't he can't fit in the in the seat of his private jet with that goddamn. What case what on else his he phone. can't fit in? Um, skinny jeans. Well, I can't fit into skinny jeans anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all saw my caboose. <laughs> that ass. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> John was behind the scenes talking about something. John was like, "Ooh, I think I got the angle." Nah, it just Ooh. like, nah, it just Ooh. like, it just like. John, you out there searching for it? No, crack kills a lot of people in the world, so it's just like. So you, you showed it, it to them, huh? So you showed it to them. They gonna see it one way or another, <laughs> on the block or on the pod. You know what I'm saying? All so. right. <laughs> <laughs> John was like, John wilding right now. John was like, just oh. bend over a little bit more. Little bit more. That shirt right, I think I got the angle. Yeah. All right, live camera three, live now. <laughs> He's like, Ooh, is that shit hot? Ooh, that shit hot. Mm. Camera two, going to camera two. Camera two, live now. Camera three, get ready. Cindy, what are you doing? Get ready. <laughs> camera three, can we get a closer shot? Camera three, <laughs> Zoom close in. up. Zoom in real the cool. mastermind, bro. The master behind <laughs> here. Is that camera hot? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah it is Anyway I, I asked a question Because I walked into Walmart And I saw Xbox And I was able to buy it But you can't do that PS5s right now um, So in, in your own opinion We was actually kind of Pre-talking about this anyway What are your thoughts on like um, Pre-coming in The talk, talks about next gen And stuff like that How's, the, how's the, um, the console war You think is going to be Paying Pre- out Because the fact that like it's, For this gen yeah, what is the next gen? Uh, next coming gen. The fact that we're in like week one or two when there's like Xboxes, I like yeah. just walk in this kind of bro because nobody's buying those. I which think is crazy. I think uh, crazy. If, if if you look back at history, obviously it, it, it's kind of gone. Um, you know, I don't know. Would, would you say the PS2 or Xbox One? I don't. PS2 Xbox one, one was it. not in the same league. Yeah, was it not? PS, it wasn't the regular close. Xbox. Yeah. No, it wasn't uh, what, even close. P- PS2 PS2 to no, this I'm day saying, is I'm one saying, of the no, most no, no, I'm saying um, Bro, PS2 it was, was in competition. It was same, I'm saying it was the same gen though, right? Oh, yeah, it was the oh, same gen. It was, okay, yeah, that's what I'm saying. PS2 was so, in competition. No, I know. PS2 is like the highest selling console of yeah, all time. Yeah, yeah. With um, the GameCube though. What? Like no nobody was comparing PS2 and Xbox. Yeah, it was the GameCube. Yeah, yeah, GameCube. Yeah, okay. Which to me was the best console. Me me too. I think it's the best you think console the GameCube still. GameCube was yeah. better than PS2? Yes. Where? Yes. I yeah. don't announce there's two, but no. keep in mind. Yeah. yeah, I got two GameCubes up here and I got two PS2. And I don't think the it was PS2 I, I think is the best objective yeah. console, but the GameCube just had better games. fucking games, bro. Yeah, they're they're like five core games are maybe some of the best games that have ever come out on console. Mario games? Where? Like, yeah, like, like Mario. Mario. They had anywhere from the Super Mario Sunshines, like the Hell open yeah. world ones. Yeah. Paper Mario's, you played a Paper Mario. Spyro. Oh, yeah. Spyro. They had those, yeah, Spyro. The, the SpongeBob Melee. game. Was they had, they had exclusive Resident Evil titles for a while. Yeah. Spyro, wait, Spyro was Whoa. on. Yeah, they did. Yeah. Spyro, yeah. yeah. Resident Evil, yeah, Resident Resident Evil 4 was did. exclusive. What? Yeah. 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 They did. The one oh, I did not know yeah. that. Yeah. Was, wait, yeah. wait. Spyro was, Spyro was exclusive on GameCube at that time? Because Spyro used to be exclusive on PlayStation. Spy- yeah, yeah. yeah. Spyro, I want to say that there... I don't know if Spyro was exclusive. I don't think it was on Game exclusive GameCube, no. But, but yeah, you're right. Resident, Resident Evil, Evil came GameCube out had all the games, and GameCube even had the games that you didn't think would be on there, like Hitman. GameCube had Hitman. GameCube, GameCube had all better. the shooters. It had all the arcade games. It had the best party games. Um, it had. The it best. also had. Uh, fun fact: If anyone ever 
wants to know fun facts about Aim High. Um, it's where I f- the GameCube is where I first won money playing a video game. Which game? Uh, Double Dash. Mario Kart Double Dash. I started and winning two hundred dollars every week because oh, my local I have mall. I a very sad story about Double Dash, but I'm really? not gonna tell it. Yeah. Oh, um, I'm sorry. It was a good game. It was, was it was an amazing yeah. game. Great but game. Uh, if you anyway. take, if you take out Mario games, though, I don't really know. If, like sure, but I mean what? you can't do that because no, 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 yeah. yeah, you're right. But I'm just saying, like, it's not just Mario. That's that's not. I'm the not saying only it's f- just Mario. I'm saying, but the, it also, goes down a lot. Also, though. very underrated. The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker was... Oh, oh, Twilight Princess. I played Twilight Princess on GameCube. That's my, yeah. that's my favorite Legend of Zelda game. You know what's crazy? I I have the, the Switch game, and I never played it, even though I've heard the most amazing things about it. Yeah. I literally had the game in the house, and I've never played it. The, you know, another thing that's crazy about GameCube is that when you first saw, like, the controller... I didn't think I was going to like it. Word. But it's, when I soon I got started getting used to it, I was like, oh, this is actually is nowhere near as bad people as I was. Still, they still have attachments just so people yeah. can use them. They have an official for, Nintendo that's for, controller. Uh, that's that's for Super like, Smash Brothers, though, because yeah. people got so good at using oh, that. Yeah. Like, yeah. I, can't, I can't. I'm not good at it. Well, actually, I'm super good at Super Smash Brothers, but I can't be good without a GameCube controller. Like, it feels weird. And what's crazy is they're, like, rare now. Like, ga- like finding a GameCube controller. Are they really? Controller, no. Buying a new one, at least. Oh, not no. like, like you can Used or whatever, yeah. Yeah. Not in Atlanta. It was hard in Toronto. It was very easy to find them here. Oh, it was? Um, yeah. And on top of that, um, on top of that, they have like official Switch controllers, so you don't need the adapter. You don't have the additional latency. Yeah. They shape them like a GameCube controller. They're basically oh, the same damn real? thing. Okay. Mm. And you don't have the added delay of the adapters and shit. Um, Interesting. Okay, so what, were you, what was the point? Sorry, yeah. Um, I was just saying like history-wise, if they were in the same... You know, generation. Then we could say, okay, like the the Sony one, yeah. and then when it switched to Xbox 360 and PS3, the 360 one, and then it switched back to PS4, and then now we're at the, this generation where I think, you know, it's it's we're getting so into the console development of technology that I think at this point, um, what you said downstairs, where it's just at this point, it's what do your friends have, and yeah. what games do you like yeah. personally, and I think that's what people go with, and I think. You know, to be honest, um, I think we'll. I want to see here in about a month or two, maybe even a whole quarter, probably so three to four months. Yeah. Um, I want to see what happened, what Xbox does to combat this because they just bought uh, Bethesda, and they bought another uh, game developing company that they're going to start releasing more exclusives. So I, I want to oh, see what they're happens there. Bro. Um, Bethesda is exclusive now to Microsoft. Yeah, but they're going to drop it on PC. I mean. <sighs> That's okay, I, I guess. Not, I mean, it's, it, I mean, for the con- for me, it's okay. I'm a PC gamer. I don't care, but Wait. I'm just saying for purposes like that's that's what they're gonna look to to say this is our draw. And mm-hmm. I just want I'm just curious to see if it'll work or not. Um, but I think probably the PS5. Yeah. No, you good. I just didn't know like when it Batista collab with Microsoft. I want to say Bethesda just was bought two he's weeks just, ago you know, or just, a week ago. Who's just trolling? <laughs> oh, he said Batista. Oh, Batista, <laughs> like Dave. Yeah, uh, like Batista bomb, Drax yeah, like Batista. Yeah. from Guardians Bethesda of the bomb. Galaxy. Bethesda bomb, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Um, but that's, I mean, you know, I just want to see that. But I think probably, you know, Spider Man is such a big draw. Bro, um, PlayStation has fucking Naughty Dog. That's game yeah. set match, and that does yeah. not drop on PC. And you know, and we were talking about downstairs as well. How you were bringing up um, the specs and stuff like that, but it. It really doesn't matter about specs because that's why they're on consoles and shit like yeah, that. Yeah, and that's that's one thing that I feel like I think about because I'm on PC. I yeah. just always think about specs. I always think about what can I do to upgrade. Um, but, yeah, console, I, I think they're on console for a reason probably. Yeah. And, you know, and, and it's at that point, like you said, I think it's just about games and, and who what their friends have. Or, yeah. You know, so I think, yeah, I think probably the PS5 will, will win. Yeah. Um, but Most I don't. I, but I don't know. Yeah, but I know last. If we look at, I want to say, if you look at the last quarter though of last gen, um, the Xbox One. So no, it didn't. Yeah, it did. It when didn't. they when they upgraded their console. It yeah, didn't. I did. I did. So, but the only but the only reason why I even because like it's funny because people will go on Twitter and they'll like brag about like, oh my God, I was able to, um, switch from 2K to um, to Spider Man and like like so quickly. Mm-hmm. I'm like, nigga, just. Go play PC. If that's like if like if they get like yeah. amazed, like they can just open up one one game to the next that quickly. I'm like, those are things that PC be, could have been doing. Yeah. So again, I don't think they like specs matters, but it doesn't really matter to the point of them actually caring that much. And I think it is a lot of has to do with um who your friend what your friends have. But even while I was going downstairs and I was talking about like 
The only reason why I believe 360 really won is just because of the price point. Because PS3 was just so astronomically high. Yeah. And the only reason why... It was crazy. Because it didn't even win, though. The second 360 lost its Call of Duty one-month exclusive content, it was game, set, fucking match. Not at that People time. People started moving to PlayStation. No, no, no not at that By time. By the end of the cycle, it was a fucking tie ball long, game. But how... That's what I'm saying. Maybe at the and end. And that's a shame yeah. because Xbox had, a, Xbox had culture. Every content credit was on Xbox 360. The second they lost that Call of Duty deal and every content was dropping at the same time the PlayStation, people looking at the PlayStation, now you don't have to pay to be online in the PlayStation 3. You have to pay for Xbox Live at the time. That and, was also a but, but, but listen, but, the, but here's the thing, though, about that. Is that that's were breaking the for PlayStation, four years. This PlayStation okay. Online UI is not what it was back then. That's that's one of the reasons why it was free. It's because it wasn't offering as much as Xbox People Live was care, offering. Bro. People want to save money. No, but I'm just saying, like, that's that's one of the reasons that Xbox was able to say, hey, we're going to charge you money because you're able to do all these and things I will say online. That Xbox Live back then was way much, cleaner much, and much way better. better. And, much better. And at that time in the 360, what like what Xbox is lacking now, exclusive hard titles that people want to play, is what they had back then. They were just releasing Gears of War, Halo 3. Um, there's another racing yeah, game that they had that was that huge. Because Microsoft is dropping that on PC. So that's what yeah. I'm saying. No, I know. But that's, but that's what I'm saying, though. The Xbox back then, 360 they won because of that. aim disappeared by the end of the thing. It was tie it was neck and neck by the last like two three years of that cycle way more people were buying playstations and Xboxes. sure i can agree with that so then but they still the won fact that, they still won the fact though. that you they can still won. they still won no no they lost the culture the fact that no, xbox they launched two days three. early hey, three. nobody was 361 by electrical college and i don't know <laughs> that electrical whatever i was trying to make a political no off. i think it's the opposite <laughs> i think playstation would have won by the electoral and then xbox had the popular vote because it was popular mm. for longer but okay but it lost itself in the last two to three years and that's 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 not just specific to that cycle. It's gonna be so hard for Sony to lose that lead. The fact that this new console came out two days earlier for Xbox, nobody was posting that. PlayStation come out, bro. Everyone on TikTok is doing skits about it. It's like the whole Twitter culture is like, that if is my girl fact. doesn't buy me yeah. a PlayStation, yeah. that used to be yeah. Xbox yeah. ten yeah. years ago. I they agree. lost that. They lost yeah. that because they came out and they were like, you don't. We know so what, what do you, so what, what do they need to do to get to get in front? They fucked it up. No, they fucked they it up. They're back. not going to get it back because Sony would have to fuck up for this point. What they, they made the mistake of believing that people wanted it all in one entertainment system when all we wanted to do was fucking game. That mistake cost them the lead when the PS uh, when the Xbox One and the PS4 came out, mm -hmm. and they never made an attempt to get it back. And Sony doubled down on gaming. They were, bro, I have a fucking. All of us have smart TVs now. We have a laptop or a phone. We could all do that shit on other devices. We don't need yeah. Sony to do this shit or um, whatever. Xbox, Xbox, so Sony yeah, just Microsoft. doubled down on what worked, and yeah. they they stole culture when the PS4 came out. Now. My girlfriend throws away or sells my PS4. Everything is PlayStation now. So even though people are buying the Xbox, not only is PlayStation blowing it out in sales, but all the tweets and the viral TikToks now is all going to be about PlayStation. I'm very, I'm very interested in just the behind the scenes. Of, there's a lot of like business rooms that I would love to be a fly in the wall on or fly on the wall for because it's like, you know that they're pressing that in like um, surveys or whatever, you know, bringing people yeah. in. Like, I, I want to know what's happening in those and what what decisions at the top are going, okay, we think that people are going to like this all-in-one media go where Sony is maybe, I guess, interviewing different people who are saying, no, we want more games or what's the, or is Sony's, the decision, <laughs> Sony's press the decision for after. Sony? I think Sony adjusted everything after they well, saw that's it what I'm go saying. Bad. Was the decision for Sony to say, listen, we maybe one guy was like, no, let's go against the grain. I, I say, know I actually, that I actually think it, I think it just takes one guy. I think I think a lot of companies just have the wrong people in the room, and they think that they understand what the culture is looking for, but, but they're not they connected with the community. This, they, they, Ooh, this is the crazy part. Microsoft, no, no, Sony has no business winning America. Zero, none. Yeah. zero. No, no, Sony none. has zero. business winning Europe. They would dominate Asia. They could probably win Africa. They would win Australia and they would win South America, the but they have no business winning and, North and America, the and they that still do it. In yeah. America, Americans have some odd loyalty to Sony. Is the like the wild A Japanese company when crazy. Microsoft is from crazy. here, crazy. Yeah. and they well. still don't get love. Hey, but I agree with you though with the exclusive things because back when Halo and Gears of Wars, that was a thing. Yes, yeah. like Those that are was reasons a, to buy the console. That was yes. a, that was such a thing, and they didn't follow up with other exclusives. I know they try to like continue. Halo and stuff like that and Gears yeah. were like more iterations of it, but they didn't follow up with the new 
exclusives. It's also harder for, I think, companies um, just to, I mean, here's the thing, man, is I think about this in in any industry, whether it's music, film, games, man, it's hard to repeat success. It you know really I mean? is. It's like so hard to repeat because it's all the small things that make something successful. Like the charm of Halo Three. Oh my god! Like how dude. do you get back playing on and a resort with your friends? Dude, and on it's Mom not Deuces. even. It's not for me, dude. I was a very, very highly addicted Halo Three player. Um, and real Halo Three players know this. Is is like, dude, the beta to Halo Three was more lit than the actual game. That was my favorite of, game. That bro, brought me to Xbox. The way that, that they, the way that they marketed <laughs> the beta the, for Halo 3. Church. No, at Summer Camp, that's a game we played. And like, they had Halo there. We used to play with the little swords. And that's the first, <laughs> that's what got me to Xbox. Fuck that's yeah, same. John. Yeah. That's Fuck what I'm yeah. fucking talking and about. A, and that's a fact. That's but, a fact. But, Fuck but, yeah, But aim. the way that they... <laughs> <laughs> the way that they did that shit... Um, and, and what agents talking about is they created a culture around what was happening. I mean, that was the first time that we we saw an exclusive Mountain Dew come out yeah. um, for for a game. People were yeah, fucking on had, that shit. Man, I mean, it shit. was just an insane amount of marketing but here's skills. Here's the thing, though, Aim. You could always win it back. It'll take like five years. Like Nintendo did it. Yo, I don't know if you guys remember. Nin- everyone thought Nintendo was going was under dead. five yeah. years yeah. ago yeah. because they came out with the Wii, and that was like gimmicky, and kids loved it, the and Wii, families and then loved they came it. Out the Wii crazy U. thing is, the Wii actually sold well, but it, it only sold well for for the uh, for other reasons. Yes, it yeah. didn't sell yes. well for like core games. But when the Wii U came out, everyone was like, "Why are we going portable?" I thought like we were getting rid of that. Yeah, the fact that they doubled down on it with the Switch is the ballsiest move because it literally could have took the whole it. company and under. They killed it, but they knocked it out the knocked fucking out park. The park. They came out with yep. games that you couldn't get nowhere else. All yep. the Mario yep. Karts, all the all the other Mario games, yep. the Zelda game, literally is some of people's bringing that, back Animal Crossing at at quarantine. I used to make fun of people who play that Dude. game, but now I get the appeal of it. But it's like across the board, they, they just killed it. Killed. All. So it's like now Nintendo's back. So Xbox could always make that type of comeback. Yeah. But as long as I could play their games on pc i have no interest but playing i think it what i was controller. trying to say though it yeah. was was just like specifically because you brought up they're trying to make a callback to gear yeah. they're bringing out new gears they're bringing out new yeah. halo what i mean what i mean by that is like listen look at the star wars movies like it's really hard to repeat success exactly. in one thing in one genre so i know that like ninja pro halo player loves halo very skeptical about this next halo because it's hard like the the previous halos i know that some people like i think halo 5 um is considered a really good halo it's still hard to man halo 1 was incredible halo 2 is incredible halo 3 is incredible halo 4 kind of sucked odst sucked halo 5 was okay now we're going into infinite new generation new software new cable like there's so many different variables that are happening with this halo that i'm like yeah. It'd be great. I, I hope they knock it off because I love shooters. I love Halo. I love that type of... I want it to be a good game. having a good arena shooter? Dude, I would love oh it. Oh, my God. I'd be very happy, but it's very hard to do, um, yeah. and especially that they're making the jump and committing to a full to a full PC launch of it as well. Mm. Yeah. scares me as well yes. because no, I'm so excited for that. the PC uh, versions of Halo that they're releasing right now mm. are not very good. So it, it's, mm. you know... But I know all about that because I played SOCOM, SOCOM 2... And at, um, Zipper Interactive just kept trying to remake the SOCOM everyone loved. Mm-hmm. And they kept fucking it up royally. Yeah. Then, the, then then another dev team called Slant 6 came in and tried to do it. And nobody fucking liked that glitchy ass piece of a game. Then Zipper Interactive had one more chance with SOCOM 4. Didn't do well because they didn't listen to the community at all. And then the community actually thought they were doing something when they were like, no, nah, don't buy SOCOM 4. Fuck that game. Zipper didn't listen to us. We wanted Zipper to do the game and they didn't do it properly because they came out with the beta. And uh, the, the whole dev team actually went under. Sony shut them down. Wow. So I learned that lesson, uh, ladies and gentlemen. If there's a game that you love and you want to see more of it, maybe don't boycott yeah, it. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> but, the thing, but the thing is that... Um, Am I right? <laughs> Am I right, guys? <laughs> Can you guys see the pain in my eyes? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was really doing some shit, bro. I was like, man, fuck that game, bro. I'm not fuck even going to buy it. I played the beta too, man. I had so much good memories in the beta. I was like, man, I'm not even going to buy it. I'm such a good guy. Man, three months three months later when they were like Zipper Sony shutting Zipper Interactive down, man, I bought the game so quick, but it was too late. <laughs> <laughs> it was already on sale for 75%. <laughs> <laughs> That's 75. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Crazy how that is, man. Two, two things. Hey, you guys are that, ridiculous. Yeah, that is ridiculous. <laughs> two things. I think Nintendo's different just because there's literally like 
there's a generation of people who've just who know Nintendo. Yeah. Like yeah, I think yeah. Nintendo is more of a recognizable name. So even if it starts to struggle for a generation, I think that's much easier to bounce back from. Well, I don't think compared I don't, to what you're talking about, Socom? No, he's just talking about Nintendo. Yeah, Nintendo bounced back. Xbox? Yeah. I think more people are just accustomed to Nintendo because how long it I is. Think, it just, I think, too, like, think about, like, and even to you with the culture and bouncing back, like, what he's yeah, saying Nintendo's is Nintendo created culture. Mario. Thank you. There's not yeah, really, but a, a, that like, I know that, like, you could, strange. you could, like, okay, like, hey, we're, we fucked up. We released the Wii and then we released the fucking Wii U. But it's like, you, you, if you get the right minds in a business room, the right minds will go, hey, you guys created fucking Mario, yeah. Link, you know what I'm saying? Zelda, all these cool at Luigi, all the That's all, all the Mario culture. characters. You and can bounce back. I you just have to do it right. We, and Wii's marketing. Plan and what is was, Xbox gonna do? We got we got Master Chief and but Wii's Assassin's marketing Creed. Plan cool. Was, uh, Xbox does not have Assassin's Creed. I'm just saying. What? Yeah. Oh, is it not exclusive? Not even remotely. No. But, no. but part, didn't but part it used of, to be? Mm-mm, never. It used to be on okay. PlayStation. Uh, Assassin's Creed used to be exclusive on PlayStation. No, nope, nope, no, it didn't. Nope. I thought if anything, it was on Xbox. Metal Gear Solid. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, um, Metal Gear Solid is now, now open. Yeah. Yep. Um, but yeah, like that. I don't. There's no way that you can you can capture. I don't think there's a way to capture that type of culture with the Xbox. That's the reason so. why I think I think the ability to bounce back with Nintendo is just significantly easier. It's though. not I though. I remember the shit people used to say. What's Nintendo gonna do? Drop another Mario game? No, I'm done with that. Like we're past that. I'm not doing that. That's that's, that's what people. I, just, are I, I, yeah, I think that's just haters. Haters, no, haters. Dude, because there's no when individual. They dropped the Wii U, no, and the only fun game on it was a, a Super Smash Brawl, the Wii, the Wii U version of the game that they dropped. And that was the only Super good Smash Brothers will always get always. sales. Yeah, so. always. And that's, Mario Kart will. Say about I understand. I, I heard people saying that they would just hate her, hate haters. Haters. That's it. Because there's no way that they now are where they're at right now, and they just drop Mario again seven different ways, and they still and it, it actually that is shit yeah, up. it's still incredible. So check this out now. When you think about what Nintendo did, Nintendo realizes that you don't actually make money off the oh, console. Oh, and Pokemon too. Yeah, yeah. actually, they just, yeah, they just, big time. They came back on Pokemon they just, games. I forgot about Pokemon. You could fight with them. That's I I bought yeah, yeah I like you that. can that that game always looks dope to me I don't know yeah you could fight no matter which way you put them but so so check it out Nintendo realized that you don't make money off the consoles you actually lose money on them you make money off attachments and games mm-hmm. and um so what did what did Nintendo do when you think of Nintendo I guarantee you there's gonna be a huge chunk like twenty percent or something of their revenue that's like fucking characters like amiibos and shit yeah all yeah. that random shit that people buy yeah PlayStation is not doing that. I mean, PlayStation, is, I don't know if you guys saw, they were selling merch for like $200 and shit, like hoodies for $200. I saw a backpack that literally was just black and then it had the PS yeah, and logo and it was, was literally it? like $200. Ridiculous. And I was like, what? But for a Nintendo, actual value. Um, because Nintendo's thing is mobile, like there's plenty of different attachments and cases and gimmicks you could put on it. Yeah. Yeah. And then, you know, you have half a controller here and the other half here. There's the Pro Controller. There's the GameCube Controller. Nintendo is off the charts on attachments. They're monetizing the shit out the console that's already doing great for them. Yeah. And it's being driven by very good first-party t- titles. Yep. So their whole business plan was risky, doubling down on something that didn't work. But they did it in a way where they, I think they truly captured the essence of gaming. Because Xbox and yes. PlayStation kind of go for, like, the hardcore, yes. like, you know what I'm saying? The people who sit down and play for hours. Yes. Nintendo went for, like, the, Ca- we casual. have 10 people at the house and we want to play Mario Party. Yes. That yeah. crowd. And, and that crowd the is the majority. One. That's the majority. And, and, and that's the only console that will, that you can really do that with. Yeah. Exactly. There's no, there's no PlayStation or Xbox console that will allow, like, oh, the family's over. Let's Which fucking play let's, Mario. Yeah. There's no Mario Party on. Let's fucking game on Modern Warfare, family. <laughs> no, 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 no because especially because they don't even put split screen in these games no more. So there's, yeah. there's, there isn't even. An op- Remember when you could play Modern Warfare Two on the Xbox split screen? Split Rust. Screen. You put four people on that shit, and then you fight your fucking friend when they screen peek. They they just removed that from the games because the consoles were too yep. weak and they couldn't have like four different games running on the same thing no more. Yeah. I dead so, ass the other day had like a. Uh, like mid thirties year old uh, friend, and he he was like, "Hey, you know, you're in the gaming scene." He's like, "Can I ask you a question?" And it was like actually a really sad moment because he was like, "Hey, uh, is there a way I can play zombie split screen with my friends at, at my house?" And I was like, "No, no, nope. there's they not." Took it out. Took it they, out. It, Call of Duty loved, Call of Duty appreciated split screen Sag so trip. much back in the day, bro. That in yeah, Black actually, Ops One and Black Ops yeah, Two, you can go online, online with your friend's split, split screen. screen. Yeah, and they took that out. Took it out. Oh my god! Mm-hmm. So it's like 
And those, those are for like serious gamers. I have one in my house. You have one at your house. So there's yeah. no need for us to split screen. Yeah. They should yeah, never We're fucking pog that. champ. Fucking try hard. Fucking land in this up, dude. We're fucking. Yeah. And, yeah. That's, and, yeah. That's, and that's yeah. the crazy part. That's the moments. Like if <laughs> any of us, like all of us know, but like, especially y'all watching, like, like those were the moments that turned me on to Halo and Call of Duty. Yeah. People bringing their shit yeah. to each other's yeah. house. Land connecting that shit up. Four people on one console, three on the next, yep. and other rooms split screening it and playing video games for hours. That's how committed people were that when you didn't have online capability, that's the only way that you know how to yeah. play. So they removed that that level of of audience, that level of like actual commitment to play with other people and just did it online, which is understandable. But yeah, you're right. They're just going for such an exclusive I think Xbox put themselves in such an exclusive box that they're competing with. They're going to always compete with Sony. And if you're going to, if you're going to just lose, you're going to lose so badly in that, in that conversation, every single generation with the way they're doing it. And you're right. They fucked up last year, last generation when it came out and said, yo, look at what the Xbox can do. All these other like media functions. And I remember yeah. when I was working at Walmart and I had coworkers explaining to me like, oh, yeah, I'm, I got to get it because I can do Netflix and I can do this and I can do that. And like literally like three years later, not even three, like two years later, TVs, just full blown yeah. TVs were able to yeah. do And that. also all those apps existed on the PlayStation too. They just didn't bother making that their main piece of promotion. But they were like, this is this is what we had. And I remember um, they were like doing like the, um, X, um, the football shit where you can have, um, you can be watching football games. Oh yeah, yeah, they, yeah. Um, oh yeah, on screen the same and screen, thing. yeah, yeah. The same oh, I remember thing. that. They yeah. were literally pushing that, and they were like, "Yeah, man, I can watch football while I'm playing a game." I'm like, "When, when, when were you ever doing that? Were you yeah. ever, were you ever, were you ever?" Actually, she was actually doing that just today. I was, yeah. <laughs> but no, like, I was. Go on. You're just staying dumb as hell. I swear to God, you. I was doing that. <laughs> but, but, <laughs> right, John? <laughs> oh, my, I'm not wrong. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but in the South, people come today. People come to other people's houses, wear Atlanta, uh, Atlanta Falcons, New Orleans Saints jerseys, and gather around to watch Super Bowl. And that's Super Bowl, but like um, Sunday night. Sunday night football mm -hmm. and like the idea that I'm not going to buy a whole console because I can watch that shit in the corner. It's like, no, like that's not, that's not what you do anyway. So why are you trying to make it seem that way? But yeah, I agree with you. They failed in that, yeah. in that aspect and PlayStation only fucked up the other in PS3 just because the price was outrageous because you had Blu-ray disc and that was literally, and it. it came out later, like way later. But I mean, I, th I still think even if the price is exactly the same and it came out at the same time, mm -hmm. I don't think people would have fucked I think, up like that. I think that the price was not as big of a factor as it coming out later. Xbox wow. coming out two days earlier resulted in so much more sales for those guys. It makes no sense. It yeah. results in most, more sales, but I, I still think that first year would have been Xbox over PlayStation just because of the price. Without a doubt. That, I'm telling you, that Call of Duty had culture in its fucking palm. And doing the month drops early on... Um, on Xbox, so you didn't get the content until a month later on PlayStation. That's a serious exclusive, and it meant that every content creator that people watched at the time were playing on, on Xbox. Xbox yeah, yeah. So that, except so that for came Wings of Redemption, he was on PlayStation. He didn't cheer. He didn't care. Bro. Did he really? He no, he used to have it. I mean, he had Xbox. I don't but know. He what used he... to be. Uh, he was like the only one I knew back then who was solely on PlayStation. Wow. Hutch, C. Anders, Tabes, Tebs. Tapes. Whatever to the face to the face that guy, <laughs> all, 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 classic all Xbox. All, all Xbox yeah G unit J uh, G unit yeah yeah, yeah yeah G shaggy, unit shaggy all, <laughs> all, all of them all of them were Xbox oh my god I fucking all forgot them. about that guy all I, I all remember all the intros bro. Fist the cuffs, you remember that guy? Fist the cuffs, well, yeah. His, uh, bringing the Xbox from me to you, cause you know it's true. Like he had his own like all of them. Oh man, oh, um, El Presidor I think was also Xbox. Yeah. I think all of them. Yeah, were Xbox. yeah, he was. Jay Z was Xbox. And you're, you're right. That machinima culture fucking mm. just. All carried Xbox, carried all because they carried machinima Xbox. started with what like Halo cinematic, yeah, uh, yep. voiceover yep. shit, yep. and then it grew. Wait, were they were they red and blue? What does that mean? They weren't red and blue, but they had they had Halo shit like cinematics, that? and I think they okay. may have just merged. Eventually, red and blue might have just merged with okay. Machinima. Red and that blue was, was like red know, versus blue is like oh dude, it's like when hilarious. Halo, they like they had a, they had two different teams, the red and the blue, and they would like have mm -hmm. like almost like skits yeah. of them. Like, yeah, skits about like, like um, you remember you remember that map? Uh, the the fuck the, the what's map it called? Starts with the B. I can't remember. I can't remember, but essentially it was like a it was uh, a, a big valley. 
Um, that's like every Halo map. Never mind. I'm not going to try to explain yeah, it. The only one I remember by name is Resort because that's the one I played almost every time. Yeah. I didn't really spend much time on Halo 3. I spent a lot of time on Halo 1 and 2, though. Yeah. I and these were, these were skits from like Halo 1 and 2. Like yeah, these were from the beginning. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. But yeah, they were yeah, really they, funny. They, should car- they carried that shit. Carried it, yeah. They carried Xbox. Yeah. But I, I, I don't they know. I don't know if they'll ever... I don't think they will. I don't I don't think they'll ever get that back. But but also no, it, it's tough to it's tough to say stuff like that because we live in a culture and just in general where like there's so many smart people out there with ideas that one it takes one idea to it's one person to create one game that blows yeah. up and changes the entire thing. So I, I'm not gonna say never, but I'm just gonna say current trajectory, I just feel like they're always gonna struggle to to kind of produce Fair that true. that culture of those games again. I don't think that'll ever happen for them. But Maybe. Yeah, hopefully maybe they could do it, man, one day. But, I mean, I'm very happy they're dropping Halo on PC because I do not want to be playing my controller. And I'm actually kind of excited for a polished, AAA, very, very legacy-based, like, all-time series arena shooter, first person. It's just hard, man, because, I mean, they're they're trying to... Hopefully they figure out the kinks right now, but that's one of the big issues with um, all the Halo games releasing on PC uh, as, of, as of right now is mm-hmm. they can't figure out the mouse part of it they, they just it, it just feels really bad and it, you play it and you're like wow like this belongs on a controller like just the movement and the ant like they just i don't know if they'll ever figure it out i hope that that's kind of what they're doing right now is they're releasing titles on pc well, like the physics the way that they jump them down all yeah that stuff. there's like uh, there's a ton of just weird like um and a lot of this comes into aim assist okay and different things like like mouse and keyboard don't get aim mm-hmm. assist so the idea of the arena, and especially with Halo, where there's longer jumps, there's yeah, longer exactly. it, you're in the air, or people their movement is weird. Yeah. With the mouse and keyboard, sometimes it feels like you're kind of lagging behind the controller players, uh-huh. um, and I don't really know what the reason for that is. I mean, if Call of Duty figured it out, fucking, it, it's different though. It's different though because but, yeah, Call of Duty is not Call of Duty is like true FPS like. It, it, like, yeah, I do you know see what, what you're saying. saying like, a lot of the like, guns in Halo, like the needle gun, yeah, has, it has aim time. Like, yeah, and it like, doesn't hit right away. It's not an instant and shot. You're, you're like the needle gun specifically. You're leading because it, it like yeah. locks yeah. on. So there's like, like some there's Star just Wars some type weird shit. like when you when you have that controller and aim assist, like you're able to just lead it better and lock on. Like you feel it almost like lock on to your <laughs> your player but Sorry, i just want to acknowledge how uncomfortable john yeah, is right now john in that uncomfortable chair. ass chair he's been sitting on for three podcasts <laughs> like, like yeah, three podcasts <laughs> yeah, not comfortable i see you laying back lows, <laughs> lows toes consistently just twitching and crunching each other i'm just yeah there we go um all right so what since we got that away i do want to make sure we make time out for my ass hurt. what you my bad your ass hurts <laughs> yeah I'm not gonna lie, man. This couch is like super comfortable. Super. I know it's like the last thing you want to hear, but I'm just like letting you know, like this is like <laughs> yeah, a really yeah, comfortable yeah, setup. Next, next episode, John, we definitely. I just been aiming for a soft chair. Oh, aiming. Mm. Yeah, crazy because yeah. we got him in the house too as well. All I gotta say to you, I know we do actually. We have literally chairs with, with cushions on them. Mm. John, all I gotta say to you, I don't want a chair too high, maybe low. Or mm. or mm. I need to find a special agent to get me. Okay. Aim a little higher. We'll look into it. We'll look into it. Um. <laughs> New podcast. You say you got a podcast. I do. I got a new podcast. On. Just had my first episode with this guy right here. Mm. Went great, uh, actually. We dropped it out. It did. It went okay. I felt like I was really nervous for some reason in the beginning, um, which is something I usually don't get anymore. But for some reason, I think it just because, like, I was attached to it. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. it was my, like, I, so I kind of felt that nervousness again um, for the first time in a while, which was kind of cool because, you know, you, you'll have like, to feel, you yeah. know what I'm saying? You don't want to be dead inside forever. Um, but, Okay. Yeah, you know, but it was good. It was so good, and I'm glad that he came on. And you know, sneak peek, Lowe's gonna come on. Um, and where, I, where can you check it out? Check it out on YouTube and where all platforms are. You just search up Aim High Podcast. Find it on Apple, Spotify, Google, Amazon, even maybe some lower tier podcast places um, like Audio Mac. No, there's yeah, one. Don't put it on that bullshit. Not, not that low. No Audio Mac. No, not that low. I don't okay. even know what Audio Mac is. A lot yeah. of um, exactly. We, but we only got like one or two. But yeah, and then the and then YouTube, of course. You might overwhelm their servers. Aim high. Yeah, you went what? You might overwhelm the audio max servers. Really? So yeah, you don't. They're really lame ahead. Oh, yeah. maybe maybe I go over there then just for you know, 
No, yeah, you can to be like, feel that we good. Just, we just shut this. Just, just send you and a couple of buddies on the website. I mean, we just shut this shit down, man. <laughs> DDoS attack, me and my two buddies overwhelm these servers. Hell yeah. They didn't expect two new they viewers. Like, they were like, whoa. <laughs> Some guy rushed in with a bunch of papers. was like, sir, the servers are down. <laughs> How many people? Two. <laughs> no, that's too Word. much. But it's like, do you ever watch Cars 1, the movie? Yeah. It was like when um, after that town lost, um, like just became abandoned and nobody came there no more. Yeah. Every time they and got a visitor, two- they were like, <gasps> Right, it's, and they got too like excited, that. overclocked, and yep. yeah. But except there's no happy ending to this shit, Aww. and it never makes a resurgence, and it, and so it just is always gonna be dead forever because we don't like that company. No, we don't. But yeah. luckily, it's not on there. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so go find it on YouTube or where all podcasts What's are it found. Called? The Aim High podcast. Mm, it's very original. It's a very creative name. Yeah, super creative name. Yeah, when is it? When does it come out? You know what's funny is real quick before I answer that. Uh, I went in to like, you know, I did the RSS feed or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you know, you got to type in like your, your title and like yeah. your logo. I went in to type in the name of the podcast and they had like a little information bar. Mm-hmm. And I had typed in the Aim High podcast yeah. and I was about to hit enter, but I was like, oh, let me see what this says. I don't know, like a hint or something. And it was a helpful thing. And it was like, tip, don't put podcast in your title name. People already know it's a podcast. And I was like, doing it anyway. So, mm. yeah, people do my yeah. podcast. Mm. I didn't. I didn't want to call it the Aim High Show. I felt weird, so yeah. I was like, "I'm gonna call it the Aim High Podcast." Whatever. Word, because uh, it's really just about being redundant. Mm. You know what I'm saying? You, you want to try and drill the point home. It's a podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you know what Hitler said? He said, okay. "If you repeat something enough times, I just want to let you know if we go down this road, there's no turning back." Yeah, yeah no, no, no. This is an actual quote. You're quoting, it's, it's you're a quoting real Hitler. Quote. <laughs> you're quoting Hitler. Okay. This is a real quote, Here by the go. way. He <laughs> said, "If he said if you repeat something enough times, people will believe it." Now give me. Now give me. Isn't a, that scary? Isn't that scary for a moment? Sit back and think about that. Yeah. And Sex how many times have we seen that happen from politicians here? That's Sexiest actually quote. very wild. How many times we hear that from Lil Wayne? That's a real Hitler quote. Yeah. Lil Wayne. That's, that's actually that was, really creepy. That was literally his strategy, by the way. Sexiest yeah. Quote. It was repetition. Lil Wayne did the same thing, bro. He kept calling himself the best rapper alive. He did. And that song with Eminem. Who's the best rapper alive? And Eminem no. was on the ad lib saying what? Wheezy who? Wheezy who? Whole song. I remember 2010. But nice, but it, he was a whole it was a whole stretch where he was just calling himself the best rapper alive. And it was a song. That song is called Best Rapper I know, Alive. I'm just saying, but with even, Eminem. Though, even though other people's songs, you just say I'm the best rapper alive. And literally, it was like for a two year stretch, people were like, Man, like Wayne might be the best, best rapper, rapper alive. alive. Yep. I'm like, Kanye? Maybe, <laughs> maybe, maybe Kanye. It was like, but he keeps no, saying it. Though. Kanye's not he's, calling himself. Yeah, yeah Kanye's not doing that. Kanye's not saying that. So I don't believe it actually. Word. I I think how it's so fascinating how like evil people like Kanye Hitler are like demonized and for very good reason. But I think they yeah. should. I think also they should be studied. Because you're, you're going down this road again. Yeah, he's he's going. Yeah, but isn't that? Don't you guys want to study how a maniacal, evil, fucking psychopath got power? No. And that not fascinating information to you guys? Nope. It's he convinced a whole country of people that they were superior. How did he do that? We should figure this. There's something, there's something wrong with it's the human mind. I, you, want, well. you want to know how he did it? Yeah, uh, what's it called? Uh, Racist. H- history simplified or sim- simplified? Have they made a video on it, dude? You'll love it. it oh, it's yeah, literally, that to me. It, dude, it's literally a channel. All he does is he simplifies like wars in, in like stuff yeah. that oh, happens. Oh, yeah. No, I watched that. I watched that. I watched and that. it's incredible. He does such a good job. Yeah, no, I watched that. I don't know if I watched the World War II or World War II. The World War II one. one is nuts because he goes all the He goes in he goes depth. On, I've on watched Hitler's. almost all of them. <laughs> dude, they're so good. I learned about a lot of things that like just the Haitian Revolution. I know about that now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's a whole lot of shit. But yeah. Um, CPM yeah. must be out there as too. <laughs> CPM has to be hot uh, tier CPM. Yo, uh, but nah, real shit. I think that's that's well. Also, not just uh, Hitler, but Rihanna taught people that too, um, because Rihanna taught people if you repeat something enough times, it'll be catchy. Uh, uh, that's not so, true. I've, I've never music, liked. She, I've never liked the Rihanna songs where what was it? Ice work, like work, a diamond work, work, work. or what, what's that? Work, song? Work. Oh, work, Under work. my yeah. umbrella. No, it works not, Ella, works Ella, not terrible Ella, because um, Ella, Drake's Ella, under my Ella, umbrella. And he kind of killed that. But Ella, 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 yeah, Ella, 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 that one. Ella, or work, work, that work, one work, 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 the, work, the work, shine work. bright yeah. like a diamond. That one work, and the shine work, bright work, like work, a diamond. I actually don't like that one. The shine bright I, like a diamond. I actually like me a lot of physically makes me angry when I hear it. Huh? Shine bright like a diamond. No, but this is me off. Here's the thing. Repetition works. That's why uh, oh, all works, the rappers sure. do it and singers do it because it just makes it's easy to remember one and it's catchy as shit and it's just it's simple. 
You don't complicate things too much. There's nothing worse than a catchy hook with too many words. Now, before I fucking pull up to your concert, I got to sit somebody, there and memorize it in my car. There was someone um, that went online. I don't know. You probably find it on YouTube, but he uh, he played like 10 or 15 of the weekend songs with the same three chords. Yes. Yeah. And it was, yeah. I mean, they but, don't, but they're too hard on these, bro. They, yeah. They be pumping these bitches out. Yeah. Now, how do yeah. you think they come out with 20, 25 song deluxe albums? They be pumping them bitches out, man. Yeah, man. Like Tory Lane just freestyles. I, I fucking think love he, Tory Lane, dude. Doesn't... I don't care. I think Tory Lane's is dope. Whoa, now aim before you keep going down here. <laughs> <laughs> like, you go down that road. I love his music. When you go down that road. Tory Lane's might be worse than Hitler right now. Really? <laughs> you know. Well, shot to Twitter, yeah. Yeah, because he shot Who cares, dude? Listen, hey, listen. Tory Lane's puts out music. Music, bro, that is fucking fire, bro. And I'll walk down that path, That's crazy, bro. bro. I've been going on fucking, fucking tour, end tour end. aim high, aim. I've been going on tour asking black women what they think about Tory Lanez. I about that low. I can't even answer that. And, and all the black sorry. women I've asked this question too, but I just asked a question to to the lady I was talking to today, and sure. all of them have said. None of them say what you expect them to say. They all go, they go well, first of all, we don't even know if he did it. Exactly. I, and so why would I go online? I always hear some, everyone just knows how every people online swear that they were fucking there. Hey, Sherlock Holmes, like you're guilty and proven innocent. And here's the thing. It looked like he's guilty, but we're not going to wait and see. We just had this talk on the Louis last fucking podcast. Exactly. God damn it. Anyway, I literally asked somebody that question today and I keep getting the same answer. People in, in real life, people think things through. Online, people just fucking jump to conclusions. Exactly. To get yeah. as many retweets as possible. Like, if you was in his shoes, what would you do? Like, if you're 3'9 and a girl that's 6'7 <laughs> <laughs> was, what? Was, was about to leave the car? <laughs> yeah, like, 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 she's a little off the henny, right? So she's, the girls get, when they get aggressive, like, off the henny, girls <laughs> get a little drunk. <laughs> like, like, what? I'm grabbing it too. I'm grabbing two strap. <laughs> Okay. Bro, because think about it, bro. But even if I fight back, she's going to beat the dog shit out of me. Huh? Low. What do you think we packing? No, we packing too. Low. Oh, my God, John. Low. Low. I've been saying it's self- Stop. Stop. I'm not entertaining. But he's not even guilty yet. So Okay, so wait, wait, wait. Low, you, you, you're you over it? You're over Tory? Like, you're not a fan he's anymore? So I, was, I, was, I, was never, I was never that big of a fan of Tory. What? Really. You a just lot, don't of, like a lot flow? of this shit sounds like other people's shit. Why, I guess, like who? Like what? Like Drake? <laughs> Stop. No, it oh. doesn't. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. no, it doesn't. Stop. No, it doesn't. Stop Tory Lanez, like Tory Lanez has a completely Stop. his own unique oh flow. Oh, my God. Yeah. He has his own unique. unique. Yes. It's unique. Yes. yes. It's yes. unique. And, and niggas are just and, talking. And I know you can't talk about no samples because if your favorite artist is Kanye, all he does is fucking sample. And I didn't say samples. So, 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 but that's the only thing you can compare him to other flow. people. His flow, flow is unique. His flow, his work, his wordplay is actually what? very unique, actually. His flow well, is I want to know what I want to know who you think his flow is. Who does his flow remind you of? He has songs that sound like, if I, for example, if his his vibes, like everything together, very. Um, Bryson Tillerish, Drake. Um, hey, it sound like a hater Demi. right now. I'm not sound like a hater. I mean, I'm just saying like this is what it sounds like. He actually did a song. I, where, I can't. Like, I can't really give you Drake. I'll give you like a smidge of Bryson Tiller, but I, I, I think that it's like, because they made the same style music. Yeah, like, love I, music. I think it's, you know it's, it's in the same and genre. I think, I think Bryson Tiller does a better job at that, like the singing, rapping type of no. thing. No, actually, hey, Bryson anyway. Tiller is he had his moment, but Tory Lanez can kill a lot of tracks. Like I hear Tory Lanez on different versions. Of that was, that Bryson doesn't. Tiller album is incredible. The the first one he did, yes. but the, yeah. but he just dropped a new song with Drake and it. That's also incredible, but because Drake, I, I don't, I don't. No, to me, I don't no. think Drake makes a lot of stuff better. No, 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 no You brought little man. Dirk out the trenches. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? You rise around with Drake's now. Yo, yeah. I think he's never been embraced. You ain't never been embraced. You know what I'm saying? The crazy part about it is on the song, I'm listening to it. And they damn near sound so close. Uh, you may not even know who's going first on the thing. Who? I don't know. Oh, the, Drake, the Drake and Bryson Tiller one. No. They sound so close that you don't know you who don't know. Rapping. I don't think so. If you know, well, I'll play it once, okay. once we're done. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's just play it now. Anyway, I don't know how we got into <laughs> Tory Lane's conversation. No, uh, I'm shooting Max Stallion. How I feel about it? Um, yeah. Ten, yeah. Ten years speaking, we don't know. We don't know. We don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I, I just like, speaking, just, we don't just, know. like in generalities, though, I just want to say that like, like I... I this may be super wild, but okay, I like let don't, it out. I like don't give a shit about like oh, celebrity like people like, 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 like for the longest time too. like when I, I grew up in a very conservative house. Yeah. I just want to say that really mm -hmm. quick. So like for instance, like this is just like an opinion, and I love my dad to, to death. But like love you, dad. we were love you, dad. Uh, we love were you, dad. like when we were young. When I was young, 
Um, I used to be not really into it, but I watched it because he would watch it. NASCAR. Okay. And there was a driver, Jeff Gordon, who was like the bad boy of yeah, like NASCAR, I know, I know right? Is, yeah. And he cheated on his wife. Mm. And like they got a divorce or whatever. My dad, I was a Jeff Gordon fan. My dad hated Jeff Gordon. And he'd always be like, morally, like you're going to support a guy that's going to cheat on his wife. And I literally, like I didn't tell my dad this because I was like 15. But now I would be like, dad, who gives a fuck? Like I, he, I'm not there to like judge him morally. I'm there yeah. because he's right. Like he's, I'm there because I like him racing. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I like his racing. I like how good he is at racing. So, yeah. it, like, to me, like, uh, Tori shot Megan the Stallion. I, first of all, Megan's alive. Dope. We're cool. They're awesome. And they're both still making music. So, fuck it. I, and she's still twerking. And she's still twerking. <laughs> so, twerking. even better. And you know what? If if it's like Tori Lanez is going to make dope-ass music now because of it, like, that's, I'm on board with that's, that. That's fine, though. Um, like, a lot of people now, every entertainer has to be, like, a personality or whatever. But they don't have to be. Like, there's some people I watch just for, like, the like Russ. Like, I love Russ's music, but then sometimes when I watch him in interviews, I'm like, oh, why, why did you say that, Russ? <laughs> but, but, <laughs> yeah. Tor, but the, thing, I think what, the problem with Tori is that he was... But that doesn't, that doesn't affect your opinion of his no, music, no, does I it? I still love his music, No, though. exactly. But I think the thing with Tori is that he was, he was pushing himself in that direction, almost being a personality because... Of the Instagram live thing that he no, was they, doing. No, you had to, but some you don't have to, you don't have to watch him as a personality. You could just watch. I'm not saying just, either, and I right. agree that you can you can definitely enjoy someone's art without necessarily bringing their personal their life person. into. Yeah, I did. That, I mean, I've, I mean, basketball players cheating their wives all the time. You know, like I, I don't, yeah. okay. I really don't care. But there's also like lines that I cross, like when Vic did the whole what thing. Was that Drake song? Side pieces from the S piece. I yeah, I guess. You never seen that side pieces by Drake. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I, I, I gotta I show you guys that after the pod. Song. Holy that cow! Um, but yeah, like, but I think athletes may be a bit different because they don't really convey their lives through any type of artistry or nothing like that. They're just playing ball and stuff like that. Right. But what like musicians like, it's like you get convicted. It's different. Yeah, because like you're you're rapping your life. You're not like you're you're playing ball. You're not balling out your life. No, most of them. Yeah, most of them cap. Not gonna lie. I'm not, but what I'm saying is that's a, you're trying to depict a part of your life. You guys think happened. Bobby Schmurda was selling crack in fifth grade? I don't think so. I'm not gonna lie to you. Maybe I'm there's a good chance he was. I'm okay, say, I don't maybe. Care, maybe. <laughs> maybe. I, I, every, time I, every time I hear that line, I just say cap. Even, even, but, if, even if it wasn't a fifth, maybe he was. Maybe, maybe, maybe he was. Let's, let's just say maybe it was Bobby's sixth, the one that like you know. Fifth, fifth is a little early. Maybe sixth or seventh. He said fifth grade. We failed fourth grade three times. It really technically would have been like in like. Wait, did he? No, he's saying, what if he did Oh, that? well then, yeah, okay, maybe. That makes sense. Some of them actually still real early, I'm not going to lie. But I don't, I, mean, I don't know how Bobby came up, you know what I'm saying? Definitely. Uh, when did you guys lose your virginity? Wow, what um, a I fucking pivot. That's a great question to start eighth with. Eighth grade. Low. You did yours eighth grade? Eighth grade. That's actually way Sorry, too Dad. Young. That was way too young for me. Wait, wait, wait. How old, how old are eighth graders? Um, Like 14. <laughs> yeah, 14. <laughs> yeah. What you said? The way you said it. Whoa, whoa, whoa eighth graders. How old are they? <laughs> like 14 going on 15. Uh, AJ, how old were you? Yeah, that's how, that's uh, how old I'm, I was. I'm a virgin right now. Yeah. Yep. I believe that. John, how old were you? When you lost your virginity? Waiting. What? He said he's waiting. You waiting until marriage? See, that's right the on, reason brother. why I can't. There's a reason why I can't. I, I can't. You guys like nervous? I was saying, like, yeah, I'm a hoe. I lost it at 15. So what? Right on, That's brother. It. Right. <laughs> right. Lo, go ahead. I thought we already. I thought we already answered yours on your podcast. But Who's I was on um, John. You have a podcast? No, when he was when his episode. Nah. Right. Oh, okay. Yeah. I was like, yeah. whoa, that's awesome. <laughs> um, no, I was. Um, I feel like you could. Maybe, just, maybe. I'm just letting you know that. Like, I just, I'm just speaking Tell that me. power into your life. We should, oh, man. Stop. Like you're just very. You're, what? I think you could have one too. I do have one. Thank you. No, no. Go ahead and speak it into existence. I saw it before. Deja vu. Hey, deja vu. Anyway, low. Go ahead, low. Um, sixth grade, but it was trash. Sixth grade. Sixth grade. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you was on you demon. Low was a dog, nut, dude. Let's go. <laughs> low was. Hey, 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 he was hey, down hey, the hallway. Can you low spitting said, game hey, in sixth hey, grade. Hey, hold up, though. Eighth grade. Eighth grade. Poggers, dude. Nah, 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 after eighth grade, I, I didn't. Say, I didn't do it again until I was graduated high school and went okay. to college. What? 
Yeah, why ain't... you stop for that long gap? That's the prime. But actually, actually, I actually hated it. How you know? You, huh? you said you still waiting, right? No, I'm saying that's the prime. That's what most people lose it. Like in high school, why I've you... already already lost it though. I stopped it because it was so trash the first time. Can I, I had say it, something? Like... I was spoiled. The first girl that um ever, and this is off virginity, but the first girl that ever gave me head mm. swallowed. And I, wow, dude, wow. I'm dead ass I'm not serious. Gonna lie to you. What? I don't even. The don't first even girl that ever no gave me head, but that's, I think it's because. What was like, this? How old were you? I think it was a year. So thirteen. If she's a spitter, she's a wait, quitter. What? Wait, what? <laughs> Whoa! He just said he found a girl that swallowed at thirteen. Yes. <laughs> Whoa! I guess she didn't know what to do with it. Hold on! Whoa! Whoa! Uh oh! We got one. <laughs> We got one, Whoa. Agent. Where you at, Agent Cam? There we go. We got one, Low Cam. We Yo. got one, back to Agent. Oh, no. We got one. Oh, no. yep. You in low? Yeah, don't low. say that shit too loud, bro. Chris Hands about to pull up. Oh, oh, no. man. Yo, I like shit, on. and I want shit. I was thirteen too. Hold up. Obviously, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> I, I hope you wanted it. Oh God! Like he said Chris Hands. Oh so my. Hey, I want to say this though. I think that it was not because she was like experienced. I think it was because of my inexperience. Like I so you getting head for the first time. I yeah, you I didn't, didn't know. Tell her? No, I didn't know what the fuck was. I, but why did she swallow though? She you could have just busted. She spit it out. I dude. Nah, you're swallowing. That's experience. I'm I, sorry. I guess. I don't know, bro. Maybe. There's grown either, women right now who spit out semen in hey, hey, no, their either, either way. Yeah, nah. You can't mess with them. Them quitters in life. Hey, you can't hey, have hey. no quitters. We yeah, taking it all the dough. He's joking, but I swear to God, he's right. Bro. It, go, it go in that mouth, man. It better not come out. That's disrespectful. <laughs> on, 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 on my mama. I'm gonna dead ass though. Hey, don't do if that. You're out there don't Destiny, do that. listening. Don't do that. Grade A top for 13. Man, Carter, you said her name? What is that? Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Yo, Whoa! Yo, Whoa. Not giving out shout outs. <laughs> not giving out shout outs. Giving out shout outs. That's yo, what she saw. The girl that was like when she, back 10 years hey, ago, you was going me. crazy. That's girl, you bro. changed my life. <laughs> That's a crazy standard though to set at that point. Because at that point, I'm yeah. not expecting anything yeah. else. I, no, 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 no. I'm at, that, I'm at that time too, though. Low, uh, she I didn't do that at 13, obviously. She swallowed with semen right when she reached her teens. She went straight, straight from 12 to a mouthful of <laughs> baby. Oh, John, John, John. <laughs> you have to stop. You have to stop. Hey, what is this? <laughs> hey, what is this? I don't know. Yo, <laughs> what I do with it? Yo, stop. Stop. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, shit, oh, bro. Oh, man. Oh, that's too much. Oh, just... man. <laughs> I mean, so serious. So that standard that was set at a very early age was too high. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. it's it's like the experience is infinitely better. Like, at this point, if if if, if she's not swallowing, there's actually no point. Yeah. Can you come there's... off ahead, though? Yes. 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 Good, good it's one. been a while since I've done it. I what? fucking love head, dude. good. Yeah, literally. If it's good, that month. I love go. head, dude. Swear. To the it's point like where, a... like, it won't even take me that long. Like, if yeah. it's good. Like, it's just. Oh, well, yeah. But I, also, I don't. Especially I if actually... her mouth is fuck. <laughs> I don't know. Never mind. Let's not do Tell us. Same tell us. Yeah, I was going to say, dude, if her mouth is wet, dude. Oh, yeah, that and wet she's mouth. coming off that with the hand, dude. I'll, oh, yeah. I'll, 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 dude, I'll don't you, bust don't that you like nut so like, fast. That dual turbo action. It's like when you're fucking with a girl long term and, like, she tries something new. Like, you know, she watched a tutorial or something. And then she's like, I want to let's see what this is like. And it, oh, no, oh, she like man. fucking with a girl and you fuck with her a little bit and you don't call her back. And she's like, this nigga not fucking with me. So next time she sees you, she got to just try some new shit. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that Glock dot piss yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm about to go lock this nigga down real yeah. quick. Yeah. 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 Hit you with that blitzer mixer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That blitzer mixer 5000. Yo, that right here is a, yeah. it's so it's massive. What'd you just call it? That blitzer mixer slobber knobber. <laughs> Yeah, corner of my yeah, cobber. Like, like, what you know about that low? Corner of my cobber. Corner of my cobber. She's a slobber. Okay. Hell yeah. Hey. Bars. Fucking hey. dry cool. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, head is great. No yeah, for it's sure. So head great. is great, but I be like, sometimes I be like, man, I, I actually want to fuck. So like, sure. I, just, uh, I, I almost fuck. always prefer head. Yeah, it depends. Because you don't have to do nothing. And it still feels incredible. Most of the time it feels incredible. Amazing. 
That's the thing. Like you gotta, you gotta really cross your fingers and hope that the head is great. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There's nothing better than good. What head, does it have bad? There's nothing teeth. better than good head that you don't have to ask for. Oh my god. Now the thing here's the thing that that's even worse. Oh my if god. The, if the pussy is whack. Oh man. There's literally nothing you can do about that. Like Wrap that's it just it. Yeah. No, you can. You could do like Kegel exercises, tighten the area. What you did? What? Well, Kegel exercises. I don't got time to exercise. A lot of women do that shit. after like pregnancy I don't, I don't and shit. I don't have to. Yeah, that's, 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 I mean, that's shit. not nothing for you to do. That's on her side. Also, her shit don't get wet if it's not like warm. It needs to be, bro. Like, huh? you say? And that like wait, wait, what did you though? say? What you say? If it's not warm, warm. Yeah. And that is, when have you ever been fucking a cold pussy? <laughs> no, no, but sometimes it's not like that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. The bare minimum of pussy is 98.6. <laughs> yeah. Nah, nah. nah, sometimes that should be mid. Huh? Mid, mid how? Like, like lukewarm. Wait, you want it hot? But that's you, though. I don't, know, I don't want it hot, but I want it, like, gripping and warm. I can feel that, that shit. That means you didn't do enough before, though, Yeah, you got the foreplay. Like, yeah, that means, that means you didn't sleep enough. enough. Yeah. Like, yeah. That's fine. That's, that's all that's fine. Like but, like, ears. if I'm already yeah. in there, like, how long do you I gotta have to You got to be in there going? fucking yeah, DJ you gotta pick spinning her right? Ten minutes. Huh? Yeah, how long you guys do foreplay for you? Foreplay, it, it depends. Dude, I'll fucking do that yeah, shit for fucking the, thirty fucking days, dude. I'll be in there fucking DJ spinning um, that shit, no. fucking you know, fucking. That's actually taking one year how, off. How long? How long is foreplay? It depends on the like girl. Ten minutes, bro. Ten, ten to fifteen. And how ready she yeah. is. Some girls are already ready. Some girls just got that. Yeah. you know what I'm saying. Make that Niagara. <laughs> yeah. Niagara. Yeah. That Niagara. Yeah. Sion Agua. Niagara. Niagara. DMCA. But listen, here's what I'll say: is is it depends too because I'm down. I'm somebody. Who I'm down for whatever she wants to do. Like if she That's if she fact. if she wants mm-hmm. to do the foreplay for well, longer, not, then fuck it, I'll do it. Like I don't care. She uh, says anal. Then I was, I was talking to a girl. You uh, never done anal before? No. Okay. Oh, oh word. you wouldn't do it? Have you? Yeah. What did it feel like? Yeah, yeah feel Um. Like. Did you wipe warm, it first? Tight. What? You wipe it first. You just went straight in, there. dude. I Wait, fucking. Hey. Oh, let's finish this. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> it was what? It was warm. Warm. It tight. Was tight. Was it what though? Like you? you no, probably did, you, it was loop. Yeah. Damn, it was cool. It was cool. I, I just, I like. Is that something you like double back go to? No. Did, did she like moan or scream? Just kind of, uh, like just. Uh. Oh, it was like or a she, slight grunt. She, she felt like she was oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then that's when I was like, I gotta get out of here. <laughs> like, get out of here. What if, what, how long did she have to prep for that though? <laughs> to be honest, I don't know. I was drunk. Yikes! Yikes! Yeah. And she was drunk. I think it was probably. Yikes. that. I was thinking it was probably that. Honestly, we were just yikes. both intoxicated. <laughs> yikes. Big yikes. So you weren't drunk enough to like make sure like let me grab the lube real quick. I mean, listen, I, I like even drunk aim knows like, hey, this is an, it's a, a foreign home. area. Like I've, you know what I mean? Like yeah. I know that like, hey, we, we're gonna have to do other preparations. Uncharted we territory. Yeah. Mm. We're not just gonna go in uncharted territory, not prepared. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Ten minutes, yeah. Ten minutes for um four plus two. Yeah, ten that. minutes, bro. Ten minutes yeah. is good. Yeah, ten ten minutes, ten. Right. Would you ever? Never. You're never. Head, head isn't four play, I would, right? I would have to. I would have head to be play? with someone for a very long time. Sure. Head doesn't count as four play, does it? Yeah, it does. Head it is does. Play. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I go longer than oh, ten minutes. Than that, yeah. yeah. Okay. I think it's like ten to fifteen minutes. Head counts as four play. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all niggas be rushing to head like that. That is four play. Yeah. If you go down and start giving head and it's dry, what are you talking about? You count ahead in your ten minutes of four play. Yeah. Because if, if we're fucking, if if I'm if I'm coming to head, then it's gonna be. Oh, that's obviously not foreplay. Yeah, uh, but I'm saying like if, if we're <laughs> we're gonna fuck. Yeah, yeah like we're yeah. gonna. Yeah, um, yeah, ten fifteen minutes of. Cause that's of too much. My dog. Her head, my head. What? Yeah, yeah we're we're what? Around, we're fucking. What's the longest you can give head for, John? Huh? What's the longest you give head for? Man, it, it You've depends. given head. It Wait, what? What was yeah. the question? What's the longest you give it for? You don't give head? No, I do. I'm just oh, saying. I'm saying like, no, giving I, I, head. I, I, whoa, no. <laughs> whoa, <laughs> whoa, guys, whoa, <laughs> I do that. But <laughs> head, giving head. We draw the line here, bro. No, 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 I'm very particular about who I who I give. Oh, yeah, sure, that's what I'm saying. It matters. Like yeah. a girl, like if a girl, I, which I I, I, I don't bad. John, I don't want to cut you off, but I feel bad about that in myself because, listen, I feel bad sometimes when I'm like I just I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I look in the camera too and say I just expect girls to give me head when me we too. have sex, and I think that for me that like it's true that they, they don't always expect me to do that, which. Is weird to me now as an as like a full grown adult. When yeah. I was in high school and a kid, I I was like that. I was like, I don't give a fuck about you. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I just want head. Yeah. But now I'm like, 
if I'm like, I want the girl to have a good time too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I, but I'm like, Facts. if I go down there and selfish ass, it's thing. not what I want to do. I give yeah. Yeah. Then I feel bad. That's and I, and I'll give it like a little. She was like, that man. Wow. What'd you say? She said that means a lot. Means a lot. Like to shit. give her head? No, I'm saying like, I was talking to a girl. She was like, <laughs> giving head is like a big part. Like, and girls like doing it, but it's like, it makes a girl better. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I don't get head, then my, my performance won't be as good as I want it to be because I'm not, you know what I'm saying? Prep. You just say head. the same thing my girls. If you don't, some girl, you may, if you give them head, they get wetter way quick. Yeah. Fuck okay. Quicker. Okay. About me. <laughs> oh. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm trying to trade in that shit low. Oh. oh. I, actually, yeah. I, actually, I, actually, I actually love giving head, though. You do? I actually, I actually love it. Yeah. I don't love it. You I like, just, the, I don't, you I don't, like don't, the uh, suffer? Like, like you say you like domination. It's f- <laughs> Did he, remember he said that? Remember he said that? He, he did say that I shit. Said, you like domination. Podcast, so, and then taking that shit. Hey, how, how do you get dominated, usually? Please stop. <laughs> please stop. Please stop. Please stop. tie you up? <laughs> there is. No, she there is. The my, one of my best. Wait, you have been tied up, right? Me? Yeah. I've never been tied up. You said that shit like you? just guys get tied up or right? something. Right? Like you get tied, right? I'm, right? No. Yeah, like you get That's tied up. Thing. I've never been tied up. You been handcuffed? Nope. Nothing. I would never do that. Damn. Unless unless I unless Try I get that. married. Yeah, like some of you. If I get married and, and, and my wife is like, hey, like, no. it's seven what? years into the marriage, I want to fucking handcuff you. I'll be like, all right, bro. Whatever. Recently, uh, and she's like, she likes it rough. And okay. like, you know, I'm sometimes listening. girls say that stuff and you don't know like how rough. Yeah. So I was trying to gauge. I was like, all okay. right, you just let me know when it's too hard, right? Yeah. So I was you trying that things, ass, and then she was like, no, no, no like rougher. <laughs> oh. And then and then. And it got to the point where I was like, I don't know when I'm crossing the line of yeah. abuse. Like Cause, between like cause sexual or domestic yes, violence? Yes, because it's okay. one thing to like slap her ass, that's whatever, but like to her the face. Choke. No, choking is fine. I, you're not going to choke I'm, her I'm very, I'm very cautious on choking, to be honest. I had no, a girl no, no, that literally wanted me to like suffocate her. But dude. not like that. So we talk about like that. just I slapping, being, like, I get, slapping I get her face high anxiety. Because like, the, the face is so sensitive. Like I can't. Like, Wait, she but that's what she oh, slapped in the do? face. Yeah, like I don't like. I. But I in my mind, I'm thinking like it's a setup. I have so much anxiety. Like, this it's is a setup. This is a lot. Yeah, I have this is so good. much like, anxiety. I'm like even harder. <laughs> What's that? Don't, don't. What, 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 what were we talking about? Don't get Johnny Depp. Yeah, dude, don't hit get me in my face, get death, agent. Uh, agent, fucking hit me, agent. The better with a black eye. That's that. That's what I said. But you, you about to get? No, like I'm. I would never. Yeah, I would yeah, never, yeah, don't do that. Just, I wouldn't even feel comfortable because I only do that to people I hate. Right? You have to be so angry and full of hate Did she to just. Spit on her? Nah, she ain't saying all that. Uh, she said piss on her? <laughs> then that's not that's not that crazy. Of, she said piss on her. That's no, not, whoa. That's what John just Yo, said. You would have to be John a ten said. out of ten freaky to get pissed on. Huh? And and you'd have to be in like a place Yo. that you don't care about because who was cleaning up piss, Pissing bro? Pissing on your bed is wild as hell. That's, <laughs> that's crazy. Would you, would you it funny? That's you crazy. Had, you had to be in a hotel, bro, and you'd have to use a prepaid credit card because that is the only way <laughs> they would find the shit out of you. You're buying a new mattress. You're getting you get Yo. a whole send. You have to get sense for the room all over again. I mean, <laughs> getting pissed. Who who? I don't. How do you enjoy getting pissed on? I guess it's a warm sensation. Oh, I didn't think about that. The warmth, maybe. Maybe. But some, but some people just like that, you know. That so, beat. like, when you get dominated, do you like that shit? Stop. Like, when she dominates you, stop. 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 You like to be smothered. <laughs> <laughs> have you, have you had, have you had someone sit on your face? Jokes. Is that what you're thinking? Yeah. I've, yeah. Oh, were? Yeah. Like well, to I'm the point where you're out. suffocating. One of my friends, not, not, not. One of my friends was saying, and, and this may be, this may be more in line with what you're, you're thinking. I guess. Do you get choked? You take your glasses off. I'll ignore it. I'll ignore it. Do you question? get choked? I'll ignore it. I'll ignore it. Low. Low. Um, just let me know if you get low. choked. Just, and don't answer this question. No, I'll low. Ignore do you get it. choked? Low. What I think yeah. is, the, my friend was saying, like, do you have attachments you put on head? Your thing? The the ones that like choke it. You got those attachments? I know you seen them in videos. Okay. You got those? Why is he doing this? I don't know about that one. Uh, Why are you doing this? Why are you gassing me, bro? I'm not putting attachments on my dick. Do you take your glasses off? Wait, what? That's what you mean? I guess I take my glasses off. Did you ever get like, did you you ever get pegged? What? Headed? Pegged. Pegged? What's that? You're gay. Did you know? What's pegged? She puts on a dildo. (laughs) Whoa. (laughs) She she does or that's what that is? That's what what that is. is, Oh, okay. Because I know you like to get dominated, so I'm just trying to understand how, though. What is your question? What is your question again? Oh, you can't get pegged. Oh, low. 
the want to pay for you. He's making it really hard. After you answer Boss. the question, I'll, I'll, I'll say what I mean by being dominated. Go ahead and go. Okay. Uh, my, friend, my friend was saying, like, you know, the like he loves giving head because, like, the the idea of him pleasuring the girl and and like the idea like he said that one of the most times that he got turned on was when he was giving the girl head yes and he was like she was enjoying it so much that her like her head was going back and she oh, was yeah. like grabbing his yes head and his yeah ears. oh yeah and like he was like I don't know what I don't know why <laughs> he's like but it just like, like it fucking like perfect. just turned me on yes. and then I just like I went even harder like it was I exactly. believe that so I don't is that like more. That's what I'm talking about. As long as she's like when she enjoys it so much that she's like forcefully trying to do some shit, that type of shit. Mm. If that makes sense, like if she's on top that's and she's enjoying it so much that she like damn near is fucking me at that point, mm. like that type of shit. That's how you yeah. like. To, that's how you have to get dominated. That's it. That's that's what I'm talking about. Okay. But any of the other shit y'all think is talking about? So you don't get you don't get. I don't get slapped. I don't get. You don't spat have like a paddle. On. You don't get a paddle hit your ass. No, no I don't have a paddle on my ass. No. I don't know, bro. On the last, yo, John, you're gonna have to run it back. But on that last uh, podcast when his ass was shown, you see any paddle marks on her? I, it was kind of red. <laughs> it was red. Yeah. It was like a fresh beating too. Like, <laughs> like, like, like you just got it. Can't kind of run up here. You, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and, and your ass still kind of swollen, so your jeans just kind of exposed. Yo. So, the, so the crack was exposed a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh man, it hurt, don't it? It was uh, fresh, it hurt, bro. <laughs> Hey, man. I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. That'd be wild as shit. <laughs> that will be wild. Hey, listen, look, you don't have to backpedal from your stance on being on being dominated. I've already what explained what I mean by that, so no, nah, you don't have to backpedal, bro. But he, he, I'm, that's not man. Like I love giving yeah. him so much so that like I actually love the idea. Like I, I get turned on by the idea of her being pleasured. Yeah, I used to not like giving it until like a couple months ago. Like, I, oh, used to, I used to I never like give it. it. I used to I, never, but I just know that it makes I, a girl better. Like, like, I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it. Like, like, like I said, the yeah. more that I've aged, the more I'm yep. kind of like, okay, like she deserves. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't deserve. I'm not. I'm not too high and mighty that she's got to give me head and I'm not going to give her head. So it's like, yeah, I'll give her head, but I don't. It depends. I don't on the really girl, like it. To be honest, that's what the guy does. Hundred percent. There was one girl though that like. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna lie. Like I don't really like the taste of pussy, to be honest with you. But this one girl, it I'm not gonna what, it taste, what it tastes like to you? It, it should have that much. It should taste like nothing. It should have that. If very if it tastes like taste. something that's not, it's good. not good. Okay, that's not yeah. good. If it has, a, it should have a very, very. If well, anything, this is what I'm gonna say though. Is this one taste. girl that I did eat out? Like it actually did taste good to me. Like uh-huh. it, it had like a very like. I don't know how to say this without being weird, but it has like a sweet flavor. Like, yeah, so know. some what? girls actually eat things. What's her, what's her diet? It. Because I know, because I know too. I did try this with a girl in high school. I ate a ton of pineapple one time, and mm. then I came in her mouth, and she was like, "Yeah, it is sweeter." For real? Like, oh, yes. Pineapple and certain acidics um, make your cum taste better, as well as on the negative side. If you eat like stuff like gravy or like meatloaf, like that has a negative effect. As I have, well I have as a car- I'm on a carnivore diet. What's that mean? Tell me, you're not tasting. Yeah, nasty. you're probably should taste Salty nasty as fuck. Where? Yeah. Um, anyway, I'm, though, um, I'm on a, um, you're going to swallow whatever I bust diet. <laughs> <laughs> no cap. Holy fuck. I may eat gravy Monday. Hell gravy yeah. Monday, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, hey, Sensational. We ain't raising no quitters to them motherfuckers. Sensational. <laughs> we ain't raising no quitters. Sensational. <laughs> I fucking love that shit, dude. Oh. Hell yeah, John. It's yeah. my motherfucker right there, bro. Let's yeah. fucking go. Yo, I'll dap you up. Y'all Let's go, yo, motherfucker. Yo, that's a wild ass. You know y'all saying, standards baby? and expectations are crazy high. <laughs> Was he wrong? Man, am I wrong? <laughs> What's he wrong, no. bro? But I, but I have. It's been a while since I was like actually not off the head because I actually want to fuck. Yeah, I sure. want to fuck. No, I do, I do. I don't. I can't do it off because if it gets too good, I just really say just put it in there. Let's go. Because that at that point, because once you get that point where it start coming up. It gets it gets hectic. Are you guys the type? Work. Listen, I'll be honest. I, it, it, especially if it's like a drunken escapade, or it's definitely like hey, like a meetup or whatever. I'm I'm fucking twice. So or I'm I'm yeah, I'm, I'm coming twice. Like so, three or four times. So to me, it's like if I come off head the our very first sexual interaction of the night, I'm totally cool with it because I know in like ten minutes, fifteen minutes, I'll be good to go I again. Say, how, how long it breaks? Fifteen minutes? Yeah, ten to fifteen minutes. Like I'll turn more. on some Netflix or whatever, and then we'll how fucking watch it. And I'll be, I'll get myself See, like, going really again, like and then 30, we'll fucking go. But, thirty minutes, 30, 40, Cause I'm like a big buster. 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah you're, you're pushing out gallons, huh, big boy? <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, if you need 30 Man. minutes to get hard just to replenish that. No, no. no. John, John's the type of guy. I see no, the vibe. He's pushing, like, out he's pushing out cords. He's pushing out cords. He's pushing out cords, dude. I'm not going to... Like, uh, Huh? Go, go ahead. ahead. No, you go. Oh. No, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I can go right, like, damn it, right after. Really? Nah, because it's like, not the right same. If it start hurting, you know, I can't. Yeah. You can keep doing it too fast. Yeah. Especially, it depends how long you have a sex, though. I, I do That's it like it. good minutes, though. I like 25 or 40 minutes, then take a 30 God, minute break. Y'all, y'all are not fucking for 40 minutes. Who not? For sure, for sure. I got you're stamina. Fucking? Wait, does that include no, no, yeah. 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 foreplay? No, no, no. Huh? You're f- that include foreplay? Yes. No. Okay, about 25 to 30 minutes. I'll fuck, I'll fuck, fuck penis in. Yeah, ah, for forty minutes, thirty, thirty. You're stroking for thirty minutes. Yes. Yeah, because I'm, I'm that somebody. I'm, I'm, switch, I'm switching. That shit is whack. That I'm switching. Whack. <laughs> no, no, way no, 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 no. I'm switching. Hey, low, 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 low. Box low. in the world. No, low. I'm switching, let me, bro. Let me, let, me, let me talk to you. Explain you. Hey, what, listen, I'm fucking, What duration you put hold on. holes in, right? I, so, like, wait, 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 that, wait, 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 how you do it for hey, 30 hey, minutes I, and hey, she doesn't I come? I have a girl, I don't mean she does. I've had girls, girls so come multiple gonna, times, hey. but they can keep going. And you keep going? Yes. Bro, but she look, comes and you don't stop? No, fuck that, no. dude. Just keep she, going? Yeah. You gotta, just keep going. You got to keep going yeah, because you, you, you got 30 more. to 25 minutes on the first time. So, like, if this is my first time with a girl, I'm going to give her that. Th- I'll, I'll make sure that she feel me. Like, if you already got a girl that she fucking regularly, you know what I'm saying? If you fucking her regularly, you, you know what I'm saying? She feel you, dog. You know what I'm saying? She to feel me. Because if her legs not shake, like, you know those legs shake? Yeah, shaking, yeah, talk like, to him, like, baby. Oh, my gosh. Why my legs won't stop moving? Because I did that. I dominated I did that. her low. I did that, yes. Dominated shit. Let me get low kill. Who you hit up with? Bugging. Low kill. This nigga is wilding. <laughs> but like, if it's my but girl. But you right though about that multiple times though. I don't, listen, I don't stop. Hey, I don't stop. This is, this is from my perspective. Yeah, when she comes, I don't stop. It's not whack because I'm, it, listen, I had, for instance. Speak it. The second time. Okay. In okay, the, okay. The second time, it definitely is much longer than yeah, yeah for sure. But, I, but I'm saying this. I'm saying this is listen. Sure. I'm somebody that I'm fucking like. Listen, we're starting out in a normal position. Then up. What are we doing? Fucking sideways. Fucking turning you around doggy style. Fucking flip, flip. Three sixty fakey off the wall. Like what do you do? I, I, I'm switching them all up. Dude. Okay, that's my but doggy about. style is my position where like. If I'm, I'm, I'm if I out. if that yes no. if I go to doggy style, I'm it done. is over. over. You are getting no, a baby. It's I'm, the otter for me. You know the otter. <laughs> you are. T- it's the otter for me. It's the otter. But I'll be switching the position. <laughs> though. It was like the otter. What is I don't know what the fuck the otter is. Oh, bro. the otter is like when you on your back. You have it's like, reverse cowgirl. Oh yeah, dude, super sick. No, it's the no, 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 no. Regular, regular yeah, cowgirl. Yeah. She's laying on top of you. And y'all making like eye contact. Yeah, super no, sick. No, low is not. It's not it. What is it? <laughs> oh, what is it? Talk to I us, Sean. I showed you. What? What? I showed huh? you what it was. What? How you show? How'd you show him? Huh? Huh? How you show him? I was sitting right there. What? <laughs> <laughs> You were sitting where, motherfucker? <laughs> where, where, actually, where Agent is at. Oh, okay, good. All right. He was that's why Agent. That's why I smell like this today. <laughs> no. What? No, it is. It is. It's cowgirl where she's laying on top of you. But basically, it's like you, you got, guys kissed the whole time? No, she got her, she got her head over the I shoulder. I kissed like the whole newborn. time, dude. When you're you fucking? She got the head what? over when the shoulder. Fucking? Like a newborn. Yeah, Unless she's yeah. doggy style where I can't like a, fucking. Like but then even then, I'll fucking grab You safety lock her up. And then you have your legs, like your thighs kind of in her. Like, kind of like, you know, a hot dog being a bun? So you got your legs around her, like getting her. Is a hot dog a taco? And you have her arm, your arm around her like a safety bar. And her head is over your shoulder like a newborn, and then you make yeah. sure her feet are straight. <laughs> yes. You just take full control, and she's on top of you, right? Yeah, she's yeah. on top of you. Yeah. So, like I said before, like Kelgro with her, like yeah. y'all, y'all chest to chest. I'm like not that. taking it. But you're bro. just you're. Just the <laughs> you're not, I'm not. I know what it is. I know what it is. Yeah, that's a good position, man. I'm. I'm that's I'm, my tap out. But though. yeah, okay, you're, you're right. There are positions where like I honestly just can't. Come or you, I have, can't. you have to do something very, very special. If, for me if, to I'm go. gonna be honest with you, John, and this may offend you, but I can't come if a girl's on top of me. I just can't. I, so, p- so I get usually if I I'm if I'm like if I want to like I don't even know if it impresses girls, but in my mind, if I'm like oh, I want to go for a while and like I'll put her on top and and I'll just genuinely Wait, I'll, just, on top, like, I'll just be out there. I'll just be out there like this, just thinking about like, dude, our dragons <laughs> no, no, real. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, with the otter, with the otter, you're doing the work. So it's like you're, you're well, the yeah, because you got it like this in your yeah. yeah. That's the thing. That's what make it pump out of me. You know, what I'm sure, saying? sure, especially sure. with that the booty. Mm-hmm. You like you like big booty girls. You know, man. Or petite. I, I, I like them all, man. I like them all, John. I like them big. I like the. But way I'm gonna be honest with you, dude. I, I I think I used to be in my in my younger years. I used to be a big tits guy, but now I like titties. No, well, I still like titties, but now I'm more. Yeah, I'm more ass. Right. I'm more ass, yeah. man. You know what I'm saying? It's like the sound of it. 
the orchestra. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like the way it made music. Like so it's so like, beautiful. So like I was saying, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Other positions, yeah, I agree. They can make me last a little longer. But after a while, I'm like, I don't want to be fucking for 30 minutes. I actually just want to nut. So sure. We just, yeah. Can we just wrap this? That's shit us up? in our old age, though, man. Yeah, I just, we're I just kind of like, yeah, we just want to get a nut, yeah, just move on. Man. And I would, I would actually much rather just nut and then go back and fuck again yeah. to make it. So is that what you're talking about? You talking about one nut thirty minutes? Or you talking about multiple nuts thirty? I'm talking, minutes? I'm talking oh, one. multiple usually, but this is what I'm saying. I'm, I'm one saying nut thirty minutes. Yeah. Wait, what, are you, what are you talking about? Say it, again. it takes you one for thirty minutes to get your first nut of the night. <laughs> Dude, that's no, wild. No, no, no. So I'll that like, is wild. By I'll, the way, so y'all talking about multiple nuts? Yeah, yeah. Like, yes. Oh, okay. Thirty minutes makes it. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, okay that makes way more. You sense. just combine all the times. <clears throat> I'm what? Are you talking okay, about? Okay, this, this, this is what I'm talking about, and I think John is with me on this. What I'm saying is, if I go into the night. 10 to 15 minutes of foreplay. Okay. I'm not coming. Right. Facts. That's right. We're 10 to 15 minutes yeah. right here. Another 15 minutes to 20 minutes of fucking. And right. I will probably come unless it's just exactly God what I'm talking about. tier. Then, right. you know, we're experiencing something yeah. else. Then we're going to take another 10 to 15 minute break. Right. Depending on, you know, if How hard the I anime show I like, and we might wait till the end of the episode. Yeah. And then we're going to go again. Exactly. At that okay. second time, I'm stroking for 30 minutes. Yeah. Okay. Oh, wait. Yeah, because once you get that first nut out, you can go a little longer without, cause you got to force that and just second a, It just depends, too, <laughs> because I'll, <laughs> let me be clear. Let me be clear. Right. Are you saying, yeah, are, you saying <laughs> are you saying, are you saying the second nut by itself is 30 minutes? Or are you saying yeah. by the time you get done with the second nut, it's, it's 30, 30 minutes, minutes no. combined? By the time I get done with the second nut, the combined total of time that we've yeah. been fucking in bed is an hour. This is that's about uh, that's about forty five minutes is where I'm at with that section, bro. So God by that first damn. nut, yeah, you times it, yes, by four strokes, yes, divide it by the first round, subtract it by a fifteen minute break, yeah. And then you add on that. Yeah, you're not adding nut. that break. The break? You had a 10, 15 minute break? Yeah, yeah. Oh no, I'm not adding. The but 10, you say you only going for like you say four minutes, three minutes? No, don't try me, nigga. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, even a certain time while I fucked and I looked, I was like, man, nigga, a whole fucking hour just passed by. Like, how the fuck that happened? See? When you in that guy, yeah, you just lose track of time in your own zone. Dead ass. I've, you I've, in the Matrix. I've never, ever, ever <laughs> lost track of time as much as I lose track of time when I'm in pussy. It's ridiculous. When it's I'm in world. pussy, it's just like, it's like I'm in a whole other state time. of time. Like, it's, it's just yeah. crazy. Indeed. <laughs> That's how it feels. Oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I had a joke that's probably gonna go too far. No, yeah, I um, you know, this is an amazing podcast. <laughs> well, listen, when I'm on here, I we just want to entertain people. That's of course, yeah, that's, yeah. that's all it's about, man. It's all about. Um, like actually, I ain't gonna lie, I lost track of time. It's already two fifteen on this podcast. Damn. Hey, the computer hasn't frozen, has it? No, nope, everything's running. What's our time right now? One hour and forty minutes. We got I another twenty minutes, like man. <clears throat> Felt good. It was a good one. You don't have to be 40 minutes of that music. You got something else you want to talk about? No, I, hey, listen, I'll talk about anything. Here's the thing, man. I'm a open book. You guys could ask me anything, and I'll fucking answer it pretty honestly. So, you know. That's good. That's good. Anything That's you guys want to know, man. And All right, we're going to end the podcast there, man. <laughs> <laughs> Close the book. Um, <laughs> listen, hey, <laughs> thank you guys for having me on the podcast. Hey, if you guys want to hang out with me. Aim high. I got a Twitch channel. I'm going to be coming back streaming November 30th. Um, you know, we might get agent on, on the Twitch stream, play a little Apex with me I every dom- now and then. this guy, man. Um, what? Oh, my bad. I thought that's, that's low shit. My fault. Never mind. That's not you, bro. Okay. Oh, you like that iPhone? Okay. I love this iPhone. I ain't going to hold you. It's been, I should have got an iPhone a long time ago. You've been yeah. smiling real hard. Wait, you had an there. Android? <coughs> yeah, the Android for the morning. <laughs> Fucking peasant. And then somebody made fun of me for having it. Yeah. And I couldn't sleep at night after that. Yeah, you should, yeah. Anyway, uh, yeah, find me at my Twitch channel, twitch, twitch.tv slash aim high, and it'll probably come up. There's a one in the I and the I. It doesn't matter. Just type in aim high. Uh, in the aim high podcast, you can go watch the episode with Agent Double Zero. We talked about AMP. We mm. talked about dating. We talked mm. about politics. Mm. Talked about a lot of things, man. Oh, talked about even you growing up in the scene. I mean, back yeah, to two K seventeen, sixteen, Old so days. calm. Uh, some other shit you were doing. So yeah, go check me out there, and uh, I appreciate you guys, man. No doubt. Hey, get off your fucking phone. We'll do also, follow me on Twitter, please. Me? Oh, me? No, <laughs> you follow me, Don. About to say. You talking about all? Love? Everybody here follows me except for John. I follow you. Okay, thanks, John. Go ahead, plug it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Aim high. 620. That's the at. 
on Twitter. I'd like to get some more followers. Um, Good to hear. And that's it. So that's all my plugs. Nice. Hey, man, if y'all listen to the podcast, welcome, 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 and goodbye. It's about to be the end. Spotify, Stitcher, Google Play. Thanks for showing love. Apple Podcasts, Google, 3,000, five stars. Yes, sir. Fuck Audio Mac. Make sure to say fuck Audio Mac. It's a big fuck you to everyone who works at Audio Mac. And uh, make sure to say, man, YouTube is available Get on a video on YouTube, peer to peer on YouTube. Videos available. If you guys haven't already, make sure to go. No, the gang, 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 gang. <laughs> on that note, um, see y'all later, bro. Yeah, yeah. Word of mouth Peace. people too. Yeah. Shout oh yeah. Word of mouth people and um, ox people, ox people as well, and the virgins. Make sure to say virgins. All right, and the whores. <clears throat> Just all the whores. Yeah, shout out to them, man. Yep. Keep shout out to the whores do, and man. the virgins. Make the world go round. Yep. All right, guys. True. Right. The virgins.